Oh no. Oh no. I was gonna do I was gonna do an entrance, but I can't <laughs> find my character. No My My stream is ruined. Where even am I? Oh he's stuck. He's stuck on this thing. Oh my gosh. Well that's stupid. I was gonna do a whole thing. I had the camera set up. I had him, so I, I was positioned so about right here, right? And uh, and then, you know, I, I popped it out of that mode, and I ran away, and I'm like, all right, perfect. I'm right here, just just there. And I was going to start the stream, and I was going to come in. Hey, it's gold cord. But you know what? It's all ruined now. So never mind. Just never mind any of that. Let's just get started, shall we? <sighs> How is everybody? Welcome. I was doing good. I was doing great, actually. And now I'm just sad. But I guess we're getting this island done today, and that's fun. Um, yeah. Cool. It would have been fun anyway. I'll get over it. So, here's what's going down. Um, we've been streaming all week. Way outside my normal schedule, so we can get this thing finished up. Completely finished. All done. And we're pretty much there. It's pretty much done. We are going to be doing the the finishing touches, all the little things that need to be done on the island, just to just to like put a bow on it, just to make it look a little more finished. And uh, you know, I have to I have to make some concessions in certain spots because here's the thing: you see there at the bottom left of the screen, it is currently December 9th. and I think it's the eleventh when the snow settles. So. I, I, I don't have any more time. Tomorrow, no matter what, I have to upload the island. I have to upload the dream address or else. I mean, that's it. It's game over. So what we're going to be doing is going around and just, you know, looking at the island from the perspective uh, from the perspective of somebody who's, who's going to explore it, right? And we're, anytime we see something that doesn't look quite finished, we're going to uh, fix it. That's what we're going to do. So what I'm doing is going into the arena today, and I was just getting some like items in here just to make it look a little bit better. Uh, so I've started putting TV cameras just in this little spot. So I went and grabbed a couple extra TV cameras, and uh, I'm going to be putting those, yeah, here. I'm thinking, so we got there and there. Um, let's move this like that. And then I bet there's a center point here somewhere. <laughs> um, let's see. So that's that's one hole. I'm just gonna find the center. Hope you finish. Thank you. Um, will the island really get deleted? Yep. If I don't finish this, I might as well delete it. That's what I'm gonna do. I have to I have to upload it tomorrow, or I should just give up. So it needs to be done. We have no excuse. Time time is ticked away long enough. Do I have any more TV cameras on me, or do I need to go get them? I think I need to go get them. I will go find the TV cameras. No, you don't. You work so hard. I have to do it. Upload or delete. Those are the stakes. It has to be done. <laughs> I hope I finish, too. Otherwise, the... Uh, I don't know. The, the Nintendo servers will be graced with the uh, the presence of a, a new... Or they won't be graced. They'll, the Nintendo Animal Crossing Island Afterlife will be graced with the presence of another island. Because I'll have to delete this one. Let's see. I have to get my other TV camera. And everything's everywhere right now because I went and uh, had myself bring myself some items earlier. So there's a bunch of items just stuffed by the entrance. And it's probably over there. There's nothing wrong with uploading a dream address for an unfinished island and moving on. <laughs> <laughs> says says the person who turns out an island every five minutes. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. You can't relate to this struggle. Don't pretend. Where's my where's my TV camera? Did I only get one extra TV camera? It's okay if I only have the two, but I thought I gave myself one more. Let me just, let me just check. 
You'll regret it if you delete it? Oh, yes. Yes, I will. Um, that's kind of the point. That's why, that's why this needs to get done, Hattie. Otherwise, yeah, we'll all be full of regret. You guys will regret having watched. I'll regret having built. Yeah, it's, uh, it's bad news. I don't see a camera, so I guess I only have two. That's fine. What about, um, studio lights? Are they all over there as well? Let's see. I don't see my studio lights either, so I must have those out. We're working with what we got. We're working with what we got today. Sending you builder vibes. Thank you. I'm pretty sure I have one or two extra studio spotlights. I should only have one familiar statue, so what is this? Cardboard box. Log bench. Toilet. Log bench. Log bench. <laughs> Thank you, Hattie. Appreciate the super chat. I'm still deleting my island if I don't finish, but I appreciate your super chat. Check the mailbox. I don't... I checked it earlier. I don't think I have anything in there that's going to be a TV camera. I can check, though. <laughs> oh, yeah. These are my... Uh, I do need these today, but my inventory is pretty full. I ordered these random items yesterday. <laughs> I didn't know what I would need today, so I'm like, I'll just get a few things. Because I want to make sure I, you know, have something for my catalog ordered. We'll get those later. Okay, so we're rolling with two TV cameras and whatever studio lights I have on me. Oh, I have stage lights. Maybe that's what I'm thinking of. Here's one studio spotlight. Any more? Stage light. Okay, idea. Let's, let's take the two stage lights and use those instead where the TV cameras are. All right. Thanks for making me scared of gold. <laughs> no problem. Anything I can do to give people as many nightmares as I've had. Another thing I really wanted to do is give the gyroid some proper seating. I don't think we're going to do that. The gyroids might just be fine where they are. Lori, thank you so much for the super chat. Appreciate you. Everyone's being so nice. I appreciate that. Um, I think I'm going to put the lights one space away from the camera. So I'll keep that hole right there. And then we'll, we'll slap the lights down and see what they look like. Yeah, that's kind of cool. Do we like that? Let's put it like there. And let's try the other ones and see how that looks. They're facing the wrong way. That's kind of annoying. Um, I kind of was expecting them to face the correct way. Let me try again. Where are they? <laughs> I've lost them. That's what happens. One thing I'm not going to miss about island decorating is running through these menus and just constantly trying to find things. There we go. There we go. Oh my gosh, you got to be kidding me. Okay. I here we'll, we'll put it from this angle. And we'll get rid of the fence. Push this in. All right, one space off. The game is so finicky about placement. It is, isn't it? Okay. And now we got to get our iron fence placed back down. But it all has to it has to face the correct way. All right. Uh, jump across. There we go. Wait, I got to clean that up. Come on. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, I'm digging the stage lights. I think that's cool. 
Uh, the only other thing I could have done differently is put them facing the mountain. But uh, I actually like the way they're facing. I think that's good. Yeah. Cool. So the TV cameras give us coverage over a couple of major points in the obstacle course. And what I've been doing as well is putting little statues around and things like that. So, yeah, it's looking pretty good. Um, I like the way it's turned out. So, it's done. I think the obstacle course is pretty much now done. I, I did have another statue as well that I can place somewhere if I wanted to. And golden vases and other stuff. Let me, let me go into a couple of the corners and show you what I'm thinking. It's, it's not fully buttoned up yet because I still have a couple of little shortcuts for myself just to, you know, just to get around and do things. So I could put something right there if I wanted to, or I'm actually thinking of putting something in that back corner. That's where maybe another statue comes in. I would have to open up this fence pretty wide here and then put down, I think it's D. Where is it? <sighs> Dang it. It's not the beautiful statue. It's not the valiant statue. It doesn't fit anyway. It was like, it was the one where it looks like he's thinking. Do I have to go find it? Oh, I probably dropped it at the entrance. Okay. Let's come back to that. Because I would like something back there. After we get the arena buttoned up, we are going to head up to Egbert's. We're going to get Egbert's Farmer Market built. Farmer's Market built. I can go this way. Familiar statue. That's what it's called. Thank you. I went and got a second truck today. So I've been I've been building out this little set for our our talent. Okay, this is these are the folks that are covering the events and stuff. And as I keep collecting items for it, I'm trying to decide if I want the backdrop to be, you know, the ocean, or if I want to spin the desk around like this. And if I want, you know, all the cameras and stuff to face this way and, and we make the backdrop something else. But I don't know. I, I kind of think this still looks kind of cool. And with another truck here, it really looks more official, too, is my is my thought. So the truck would go about, you know, here-ish. I'd probably pull it up like that. And it, it, it makes it look like there's TV trucks. You know, they're 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 right here getting everything set up. Oh, I can't push it anymore. I would have liked to have them just a little bit farther away from the set. It's not a huge deal. Hey, Dongela, how are you? This looks good and all, but what would it look like in silver? I, I don't, uh, yeah, we'll never know. <laughs> Thank you for the 14 months. How are you? Everyone should be subscribed to Dongela by now, I would hope. Or or is it, sorry, am I saying that right? Don, Dongela? Because it's Donnie and Angela. I, I'm, I apologize. I'm trying to say it the way I've, I think it's supposed to be announced, pronounced. Maybe it's the J. I don't know. Reading is not my strong suit. Look at Koi. How about diamonds? How about... We don't have any diamonds, Koi. 14 months for you as well. You should all be subscribed to Koi. Look at everybody hanging out. Thank you. Where is my... Yacht. I need my yacht. I can't find it anywhere. I've seen it three times. Where is it? Maybe I maybe I'm making it up. Maybe I don't own a yacht. What kind of gold core person doesn't have a freaking yacht?
Tom, how are you? I can't find my yacht. So we're on we're on the hunt for a yacht right now. It's the yellow leaf. Oh, right. I you, thank you. I did do a customization to my yacht. I thought you guys would enjoy this. Thanks for reminding me. Um and I also thought, yeah, having the yacht in the background here might be good. You're definitely not part of the yacht club. Yeah, that does seem that way. So I'm actually thinking of putting on these rocks, uh, just having it kind of in the background. <laughs> I had to do it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It it was it was necessary. Alex, how's it going? There we go. Something something in there. Well. Yeah. Cool. There's gonna be palm trees back here. That's all that's like I'm putting the yacht back there for fun. Kind of like a little Easter egg. But uh, the rest is going to be palm trees. I don't have any other plans for the sand over here. We need to get a little, uh, a little ch broadcaster's chair. And then I also grabbed... Uh, we, can, we can pick this up. I grabbed some cones. And these are just for the safety of the folks doing their broadcasting. Uh, this is to keep out, you know, pedestrians. We want to make sure that people know they're not supposed to be back here. This is off limits. I didn't have a lot of items that could represent that. So there we go. We got just a couple of cones hanging out, doing cone stuff. And then I even grabbed a couple of director's chairs. So that the producer and everything, they have somewhere to sit. Good over there. Should it be should it be right there. Or maybe they should be facing this way. Oh. Maybe they should be looking at a monitor. That would be cool. I probably do have a uh, a monitor somewhere. Perfect. So a couple directors hanging out, doing director stuff. We'll, we'll have to move them back a little bit if we do like a, a monitor situation. So we need a chair and a monitor. Let's put our, our storage shed back on the beach here. Thanks, camera action. Neptune, how's it going? How is everybody? Brings me in. Thanks for getting links for everybody. All kinds of fellow creators hanging out today. So if you have a minute... Go check out their channels. If they're making something you like, hit subscribe. Where are my TVs? Speaking of things I like, where are the TVs? Do I not have any TVs? I have more cones. I had no idea that I had all these cones. I might have to settle for something else if we don't have a TV. Oh, you know what? They might be little tabletop items. Maybe it'll be easier, easier to find if we filter in here. Uh, there's a laptop, and there's an iPad, but I don't see just, like, a little TV monitor. Well, the Nooks often sell TVs, so maybe we'll get lucky, but if there's no TV, there's no TV. Okay. Hold <laughs> it, pause. <laughs> I don't think I've been in here today, so let's see what we got. We have so much to do. Very little time to do it. If you're just joining us, I need to get done. One way or another, this island gets finished today. Whether I like it or not, the dream address has to be uploaded tomorrow. So, we're doing it. We're finishing this freaking island. It is going to be done. It basically is done. We're not we're not panicked. We're not super panicked. It's going to be fine. 
So our directors don't have any monitor to look through, but that's fine. I would have liked that for them. But you know what? They're sitting close enough. They're going to be just fine. Do I feel bittersweet about it? Uh, I'm ready to move on to other things. But yeah, it was, it was a good time. It's not like... It's not like I'm necessarily like, oh, good, it's over. But at the same time, I'm going to be excited to move on to other things. Maybe our broadcaster should just sit on a little stool or something? What what else could I give them? The only other thing that would work is like one of those little office chairs or something. The ones with the wheels on them. And I don't have anything like that. So... I'm kind of thinking that this this is the best I can do. We're just now we're just improvising. There. Okay. <laughs> this is good. Ugh. Perfect. Now we can do some TV. You're not excited that it's over, but at the same time, yes, you are. <laughs> yeah, exactly. On-air sign's just going to stay right there, I think. Uh, this is this is great. So this little spot here on the on the beach for our uh, TV broadcast is looking good. I'm very happy with it. I think this is nice. Uh, the only thing I would love to do is have these trucks pushed back just a touch. Both of them. And yeah, they're, they're pretty cramped. So we're actually, we don't have enough, we don't have enough room. <laughs> gyroid crew. Uh, can gyroids sit in chairs with backs on them? Because that would change literally everything. But I don't think they can. I know I can put them on the stool. Let's just grab three or two random gyroids. I don't know. Nope, they cannot sit in the chairs. <laughs> Dang it. Uh, let's let's get. Who do we want to broadcast? We need to pick out a, a good. We need to pick out a good gyro broadcaster. I don't see why they can't sit in chairs with backs on them. That would be awesome. Okay, now broadcasters are supposed to be handsome and and witty and uh, mostly handsome. So what are we going to do? I think maybe Squeakoid, right? Probably Squeakoid. Perfect. <laughs> Squeakoid is very commanding. All right. And, and knows how to project. So I think Squeakoid was a good choice. <laughs> it's pretty freaking good. Okay. Neat. Um, now, one of the other things I've been doing around the arena is putting these uh, plant partitions on the top. Because I wanted something up there. But I don't, I don't want just those. Maybe some flowers. I don't know. Let's go. Let's go check our flowers. We don't have many of these. We, these are. Uh, <sighs> these are kind of sparse. I don't know what to do. I kind of need these for cliff decorating later. So maybe not flowers. What little items, maybe in particular crafting ones we need to look at, what little items would you guys put on the cliffs in front of the plant partitions? So up there. 
it's got to be just a little something. Maybe it doesn't, maybe you don't need anything, but it'd be kind of nice to have something up here. Mushroom stools, glowing moss balloons. Okay, we can do those. I don't know if they'd fit the vibe per se, but we can definitely do those. We have lilies of the valley, so we could do those. And they'll probably want to grow on these cliffs anyway. Flower boxes? Flower boxes. As soon as you said that, I started thinking of the ones in Dreamlight Valley. I don't necessarily know if I want gold nuggets. But yeah, gold mushrooms are an option. We could make those. Oops. I only have four floor lights. That's all I got left. It could be these cube lights. Um, they're very... I don't know. <laughs> cube -y. We could do maybe... Um, <laughs> if these weren't so obnoxious, the sirens would be kind of fun. We could do... I don't know. We only have four candles. Never mind. Oh, wait a minute. What about what about uh, candles that I can craft? Naru, how's it going? Yeah. What about that? What if we what if we went what if we went into here? And we crafted up some of these, and we place those up there. I think that would look pretty cool. Yeah. Let's do that. We'll grab some more gold nuggets. And, well, where are they? Here we go. I think I'll just go ahead and grab a crafting table as well. Because we should have a bunch of those. Here we go. Somewhere. Yep, oh, here we go. Festive flag lights, festival flag lights, they're uh, a great item that I do not have enough of. I'm gonna go candles. I need something that's going to be, uh, what do you call it? Like, uh, it fits the kind of rustic vibes we got going on. I don't know if rustic's the right word, but. I'm just, I'm trying to keep it on in some kind of theme. I don't know. And we could put Lilies of the Valley up there as well. Xena, how's it going? It's too late for bushes, unfortunately. They won't grow in time. Okay, my pockets are very full now. In order to do this, I have to pick one of these up, except my pockets are full, so I can't. That's fine. That's okay. We can we can work around this. We'll drop that. Nope. Oh my gosh. Drop. Pick this up. And then let's place the candles down. Is that too... Is that too far away? Should they be closer to the... Oh, they can't be any closer. Alright. Alright, good to know. Oh, random island visits to take bushes. We could try that again. We tried it last time and we, we came up short. But we can do... Uh, a Captain Island and see maybe if we get some bushes. And before we place this here, should we put like a gold vase up here? I'm just trying to also dump some extra gold items around. I think that looks pretty nice. Okay. 
Okay. Perfect. Steal the bushes from your other islands? I don't want to do that. Okay. That feels a little more finished to me. Rather than just having the plant partitions up here with nothing else. That just feels a little bit better. And as I think about other things I could do, there is always the opportunity to put down more of those paths that I've been putting everywhere. But I don't think I'm going to. Uh, I've been kind of at a point where I'm using those less. So, yeah. I think we're good. Nothing needs to be behind these. I think that's good. It's a shame. The arena's not getting the love and attention that I know it could really benefit from. But it still doesn't look bad. That much is true. Got a lot of gold base here. Is that all I had for candles? Okay, we'll come back. Is this where the spectators stand? Yes. It's a very dangerous dangerous uh, game they're playing there. They could definitely get hurt. So I've made sure to put them up there. Especially with fire and everything else. Yeah. Alright. Candlesticks on top of cube lights. That would give them a little too much more height than I want. But you could, in theory, yes, you could do that if you wanted to. Okay. I'm putting down a vase right here. Oops. Okay. Perfect. And then a gold rose is going to go right here. Yay! We have to make more candles. I'm putting stuff down is helping the inventory. Oh, come on. So, how much room do I have? Oh, you got plenty. Got plenty. I also have gold bars if I want to put other little items up there, but I probably don't need them. There is one thing I'm being cautious of with this build. People doing it, who are going to be timing themselves trying to finish, probably don't want so many items placed down that they're lagging into, uh, you know... <laughs> they're lagging into really bad times, right? They they want to make sure they can try and finish under five minutes. And uh, therefore, it's going to be important for us not to put too many things here. All right, we'll head back over. I saw a present, but I'm not super interested. Although it could be a TV. Oh, shoot. I didn't mean to do that. Okay, gold candle here. Should I see what's in here? I might as well. It's already right above me. Oh, don't do... I hate that. <laughs> Strappy heels. Great, thanks. Ruining my build for no reason. Okay, moving on.
Gold candlestick here. Sassy? It's a strappy. You're confusing me. Try the heels on? No! No, I'm not going to try those on out of spite. I'm tr I'm trying I'm trying to get this done. There it is. Perfect. Okay, I think this cliff up here is done. I'm curious to see if the strappy heels are the gold version. Wait, they have gold ones? They're not. There. Now we know. What should I put right here? I kind of need an item for this spot right here. And, and I don't have any pillars that look good with these walls. Because I originally just thought, oh, throw a pillar right here. And I already have a vase over there. The heels? No, I'm not putting the heels up here. Oh my goodness. A statue? What kind of statue? You can put a pile of cash, but that's a pile of cash is a little small. Let me see what I have. beautiful statue would fit. I'm using it so close by already, though. Um, it would fit. Let me open this. We can find something, right? I'm not going to have a lot of options. So these are the pillars that I have, but yeah, in my experience, none of the customizations work. And then these frozen ones are too frozen looking. A lot of this stuff I'm looking at right now doesn't fit the vibe. I could, you know what? I could put this lamp, street lamp with banners. I have this extra street lamp with banners. It feels a little silly to put it so close to that other big, big light we have over there, but it is tall. And then there's this stuff. Also, some of it kind of tall. But, eh. Soon banners. <laughs> mm, try to find some stuff here. I'm going to need the sign for the front of the build. Swords. These are kind of tall. Uh, I do not have an extra Pisces lamp. Although, I would like to have that there. It's a great item. <laughs> Gold toilets actually going in the uh, entrance to the maze. Let me look at the gold stuff real quick. We could put the gold plate armor up there. Obviously, been using that kind of all over the place, but uh, one more wouldn't hurt too much. In terms of tall gold items, there's not really a lot. I could make one of these, but... Uh, Let's go try the street light. I have to I have to start making some quick decisions here. I don't know if this will even fit. 
Oh, it does. Hey, that's not too bad. I think that's a pretty good object there. I want to see it from the top, but yeah, I think it's pretty good. All right, yeah, let's do that. Now is the arena done? One of the one of the things we have to do is get our sign set up. So you did see that I grabbed a uh, a plain wooden shop sign, and I have a few customization kits. We need to customize this with some uh, context, and that context for me is going to be this sign that I made right here. Find eight gold. I'm trying to decide. Should it be a white sign, a dark wood sign? Probably dark wood. Find eight gold. And that's going to go right over here. So anyone who visits, I just want them to, to know what's what. I think I can push it in. Ah, come on. See, that's the ideal spot for it. Find eight gold. I wanted a second sign. And it would it would tell them to do it in five minutes. What do you think? It would be unfortunate because I'd have to put them I'd have to put it back here and I'd have to put this over here and then the other sign right next to it. You can still walk around them. But it would work. Sierra, thank you. Appreciate you. Maze is sponsored by Johnny Two Rugs. Uh the other other problem is I never made the in five minutes sign. Can you duplicate a design? If I do change, it just brings me right into this menu. Which doesn't help. I want to duplicate it so that I don't have to redo all the work. Where, display, or change is all I can do. Uh, there's also... S oh! Swap and copy! Uh, there we go. Yeah, okay. I just saw it at the bottom. All right. Perfect. Now we change design. Whew. Okay. This is gonna. This is already saving us some time. Okay. How do I want to word this? So find eight gold. Um, under five minutes. Right? So we put five in the middle where the eight is. And then under and minutes or mins at the bottom. And that would be pretty clear. So if you don't read the bulletin board in the front of the whole island, which you should, uh, you'll at least have this bit of context. I wanted to make it so people don't have to read that bulletin board. So find eight gold in five minutes. Um, or under five minutes. Okay, which one would be my eraser? Probably this one. Uh. <laughs> okay, my my five is an S right now. I don't know what to do about that. How do you make a five? I know it's a pretty stupid question. Like, what what could I do to this to make it look more five-like? Do I delete this up here? Oh. And then maybe this one here? That's an S. That's 100% an S. Take out the corners of the curves on the bottom of the five. Make the bottom a circle. So you mean 
So, oops. You mean this? But we, we put back. Oh, yeah, that's a five. Okay. All right, got it. Thank you. Five minutes. The font I've been using, I always do this as well. Um, I don't know why I've been doing that with all the lettering, but it, I don't know, it has a different look to it, so I've just been kind of doing it. So I'm just going to do that again. Okay. Now I got to fit the word under up here. I'll show you how I've been kind of ma managing this. And it uh, it's a good method. It kind of works. I just messed up. Let's go in a straight line here. So what I've been doing is I've been coming in here and going, okay, how wide do I want my letters? Well, I have a longer word, so I probably want the spacing to be not two away, but one. Yeah, I could just do the word in if I have to, in five mins, but I wanted to try under. So I think I could do the U like that. U, N, and then we're putting one space between each one. Here's the D. Und, and then E. I think the R would be like that. So we actually have a couple squares left over. So I can move, I can either shuffle the whole word over a little bit or I can try to put more gaps between them, but I don't think that'll work. Because let's see, that would be one, two, three. Okay, that would add four squares to it, so that would definitely eat into my space. Okay, so let's move everything over one square. So basically my strategy is to do the tops of the letters. And it's been kind of working out. Okay. Yeah, there we go. And now we can do it. There's U, N, N's are always kind of a challenge, D, E, R. I probably can't do my thick font, right? Hey, Crystal Casey, I just made you a sign. Do you want the code? Oh, <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes, I do. Thank you. I don't know what it says, but I'll take it. <laughs> Under five gold. So we, yeah, we can't do our fancy font like that, but this works. It, on the on the on this thing, it looks like a V. You see that? Vunder. Do you think people will will think it's a V? Should I should I do it like that? Or maybe like that? Yeah, that looks good. That looks good. I'm gonna do that. Okay. I don't think I want to try the word minutes. I think I'm going to go straight for mins. I'm relatively new follower. How long ago did the island start? And then Alex was saying probably around mid-2021. Yeah, that sounds about right. 
It was before the 2.0 update. And then the 2.0 update came out and, and that that was awesome. But I still took a pretty long break. That's how much gold it costs to enter. <laughs> uh, okay. I need to fit mins now. It's four letters. And I think we'll put two spaces between each one. And we'll we'll start with the I. So here's the top of the eye. It will be five wide. So, and then here's the M. That's too far though, isn't it? I'll have to figure out the M. Okay, something like this. Uh, I messed up the S. Oh, Crystal, you didn't have to do that. Okay, you didn't have to do another super chat. I was waiting for you. The code is there. Uh, I don't expect you to use it, but I think it'll make you laugh. <laughs> Thank you. I'm going to I'm gonna grab it real quick and put it in a different tab so I don't lose it. Um, it actually doesn't look like a complete code. It looks like there's... Oh, no, I see the MO. Never mind, never mind. I got it now. Okay, thank you. And thank you for all the super chats. You're very kind. Um, I will look at it right after we make this sign. That is a messed up S. That S has seen better days. <laughs> okay, there we go. That And that S is puffing out its chest. Like, well, you got a problem? Okay. We need N... And then M. Yeah, that works. Under five mins. Perfect. Yeah. Do I want to take away that? Yes. And maybe that? Yes. Okay, yeah, that's great. What a great sign. We did we did a fantastic job. All right. Under five. The M looks odd. You're gonna make me self conscious about the M now. Under five mins. Now it does look ah oh, it does look strange. All right, I'll fix it. Dang it. Okay. Would it would it look better if I did that? It kind of would cuz of the U. Thanks for always making me laugh during your streams. Jen, thank you. Appreciate the super chat. I don't deserve all the super chats everybody. But thank you. Okay, so we have our second sign set up. Let's let's go ahead and put it in place. This is the dream right here. This is what I wanted. I wanted two signs explaining what the heck you do over here. And we got that now. I was afraid that if I had to remake the sign from scratch, it was going to take all day, and it would have. But because we were able to copy it, we were in good shape. And it didn't take much time at all. Now, finding the sign I'm going to put it on is a whole different story. That's probably going to be an issue. Oh, we found it. We're good. What made you decide to start streaming and playing games on YouTube? I like it. I don't know. That's a hard question to answer. I've been doing it for a very long time. But I like it. I like broadcasting. And there's certain games that I like. Um... And I wanted to entertain people. Or or inform them. Etc. 
It took under five minutes. Did it? I don't. Uh, I know the sign said it did, which is you know that's kind of how misinformation works, right? Like we all see something and we just believe it when we read it. But I want you to know this did not take under five minutes, even though the sign says it did. Find a gold under five minutes. It's perfect. Do you like streaming better than the videos? Um, yes and no. I love I love streaming and uh, I like not having to edit a video afterwards. But I like the control you get with a video. It's just editing takes a really long time. But yeah, um, interesting question. Matt, how's it going? I'm doing good. How are you? Uh, okay, Jen, or uh, sorry, Crystal gave us a, a code we got to use. Also, I found a balloon. What do we suppose is in here? Five iron nuggets. Cool. I read find under 85 gold minutes. <sighs> Great. Thanks. <laughs> find under 85 gold minutes. I hate all of you. Thank you for ruining my signs. Listen, if you want to read that and confuse yourself to the point where you can't participate in the arena, that's your problem. I know what they say. I know what they mean. <laughs> you figure it out. I'm done. Is this design ID? I think I think MO is design ID. Yes, it is. Okay, here we go. DD4M. Okay. CD8Q. And you all chatted and it's gone. Uh, 5LMT. Boom. Donating not required, but yes, it is. <laughs> oh, man. There we go. I need that in a villager's house, but we've already done all the villager houses. Thank you for the sign. Oh, I like the way the stage lights work back there. That's kind of cool. All right. So, we did it. I think the arena's ready for... Uh, uh, what do you call it? Battle? I guess battle. I'm going to go ahead and grab the tools that we need. Put in the entry. Yeah, what do you think? Like right over here? Oh, here's the shovel. Uh, I need to make a ladder. Making a ladder is worth the $7 in donations. But then you also had to make a sign. I mean, was that all worth it? That's all that effort. Where's um, uh, supplies to make a ladder? Oh, I finished up Marshall's yard today. I put I put a few things up in here. I think it looks a lot better now. I was trying to go for a cluttered vibe, so I think it looks cool. Your island is gold. Is your island gold? Yes, the island is is gold core. It's gold throughout. What? Uh, Ladder. I, I keep forgetting what I'm doing. So the ladder is created when you make when you grab f four pieces of all types of wood and cram them together somehow. Fortunately, I have barely enough. All right, craft it up. This should be everything our contestants need. Should be. Marshall and Coco are home. Well, that's cool. All right. So I'm going to put the shovel over here. And put the ladder next to it. 
and then they have a timer right there. So everything you need. The last step, as I've said, is to uh, close everything off. As you can see, I have some gaps in my fencing here. I need to go get some extra fencing. We're gonna we're just gonna close everything off. Button this thing up. And we gotta find that statue too. I just wanted to put that in the corner. I, I filled it with statues. And it was just because I put statues in the front and I wanted some decorations in there, but I didn't want to over decorate. So I thought the statues were nice. I gotta be honest, um, it definitely is not the prettiest part of the island. And I'm aware of that and I'm okay with it. Am I fully okay with it? No, it's fine though. I will get over it. Um, and then what else am I doing? I was grabbing, I was looking for that statue, but I think it's at the entrance. Fences. I always associate fencing with furniture. That's why I get lost constantly. Oh, do I not have any more? Oh, okay. <laughs> I will grab some iron then. If you want to find all the gold in five minutes, the arena catches on. If you don't find it, the arena catches on fire. Ah, uh, see, I got to do that. How do we do that? <laughs> Is that possible? Okay. Uh, fence. Neat. Let's go grab some more customization kits because I know that I'm going to need more. And I'm out. Have you got a bamboo doll for the winners who make it through the maze? You have to include the best item in the game. That is true. Um, you can't really have... You can't have that epic maze and not reward them with getting to interact with the best item in Animal Crossing. Where would I put it though? I don't have, there really is no end of the maze because you can kind of, you, you can kind of do it in different orders, you know? It really depends on which way they want to go. You're already carrying too many things? Are you serious? Maybe that's your problem. Help me get rid of some stuff. This is your problem now, guys. Uh, help me get rid of I need all this stuff. Help me get rid of... Uh, do I not have... Oh, no. Mm -hmm. What is the pine tree? I know what the pine tree is. Oh! These! The heels! Yes! Oh, you know what was funny? Do you see the soup next to uh, Timmy's nose? And you see how it's kind of like, there's a little bit of uh, steam coming off of it. I thought that was the shoes. <laughs> I, I just, I looked up for like a split second and I thought the shoes just stank that bad. And which made me really self-conscious because I only tried them on for like a second. Oh man. Bamboo doll is based off of bamboo cutter and folk bamboo cutter folktale. Oh, fireworks too, but I don't know where to put them. Where would I put all that stuff? I mean, these aren't bad ideas. Are they selling fireworks right now? They're selling party poppers. going i always come in here <laughs> when my funds are low and then i try to stock up on these things and it never works i'm just chronically out of customization kits like look how fast my money's going this is robbery oh my gosh i'm so angry right now just here take it take all my money Next time, just let me buy it all at once. 
curious to see if we're gonna get a 2023 arch. I am dead curious about the 2023 arch. Oh my gosh. I I really don't know. I know, okay, listen, there's if when anybody says, oh hey, will Nintendo blah blah no, the answer is always no. If you think Nintendo is gonna do anything to Animal Crossing since the 2.0 update, just remember that the answer is automatically no. However, why on earth did they not make more of the arches and put them in the game? That doesn't make any sense. It they're two years, just two years of part of, of the of the New Year's arches? That doesn't make any sense. Like that's like the one item. I think that item is our last hope. Let's look at it this way. If Nintendo doesn't give us this item, if they decide not to, then we know they are done with Animal Crossing. Like they will never give us anything again. Buttheads indeed. Yes, we can call them buttheads officially. I think that's right now that's their Twitter uh, banner. It just says, if we don't give you the 2023 arch, you, you are legally allowed to call us buttheads. And I will. Maybe they're a year behind. Well, whatever the case may be, I think they could do it. It's not, at this point, a hard item to model because the model's already done. They just got to add a three to it. And they probably, they you know what? Someone probably already made it. <laughs> I also, there's something else I'm very confused about, guys. When the 2.0 update came out, I maybe I dreamt it, but I thought I saw an article where somebody showed a picture of all the arches lined up. They like had made them through the rest of the 20s, I think. And they showed a picture of them all lined up. So it's one of three things. Either I'm making that up completely. Oh, I forgot my statue again. Either I'm making that up completely, which is the most likely. Um, or the second most likely is that somebody did that. They showed it, but that doesn't necessarily mean they exist. Yeah, fan art, basically. Um, or the third option is that they are in fact coded into the game already and someone found them forever ago and we all just collectively forgot or didn't see that post and we all just assume it's not in the game when it really it is. But I mean, if people like Mayor Mori are saying it's not in the game, then who am I to argue? So that's, that's how I feel. Um, I, I, I feel like they might already be in the game, but they're probably not. I think I made that up. I think my brain made that up. Log bench. Familiar statue. Here it is. Are these the same fences? They are. Okay, didn't think so. It was probably a Photoshop fan art thing. They're working on my. They're working on a new console. Well, yeah, Nintendo and everybody. Everyone's working on a new. That's fine. I, that's that's all good. You can do two things at once. <laughs> you can make us a 2023 arch and work on the next version of the Switch, whatever that might be. I can't. Okay, now it's not letting me. There we go. I want them to do it. I want them to give us the 2023 arch because, well, I play this game on YouTube and I, it would mean I get some views. <laughs> that's that's like one reason. But also, how am I supposed to celebrate New Year's without the proper, without the proper uh, items? There he is. He, the, it's funny because he's pondering which one of these is not a pitfall. Okay. Place that there. Place that right there. I think we did it. I think we've sealed off the arena. It's officially ready for gameplay. It's going to be me if you delete the island. <laughs> Fishball, how's it going? 
I'm looking for gaps in the fence. Just, you know, just triple checking here. All right. Can I get through? Is it is it sealed off? It looks like it's sealed off. Good. Okay, we did it. We did it. There is one more spot, I think. I, I can go outside the arena and get it. Tracy, how's it going? I could see it being purple and pink. The purple and pink arch for some reason. I wonder if we saw it. It's kind of like... Uh, Oh, didn't someone, I think I, this is why it just came to mind. Someone in chat mentioned it a second ago and I like, my eyes skimmed over it. Someone mentioned the Mandela effect. Yeah. I think that's what we might be dealing with here. It might already exist. The, the item may just... Ugh. Jump! Temperamental. Anyway, I, I wish us Animal Crossing players luck. I, I hope Nintendo comes through for us. Even though I'm pretty sure they won't. Debbie, how's it going? Okay, let's take care of the area outside. Valley spot look, looks great. Love the gold fencing. Thanks. Everyone kept making fun of it and calling it yellow. And uh, they wouldn't believe me that it's gold. Oh, it's, did I seal this off already? I did. Okay, good. It's done. The, the arena's done. How's my inventory? It's bad. It's very, very bad. I need to do a reset of my inventory because most of the stuff now I'm not going to be using out here. So, What is gold if not metallic yellow? <laughs> Somehow, somehow gold is less exciting now after you saying that. That's, I'm kind of glad this island is done because you just made it sound so unexciting. Uh, okay, I got my gold roses, got my trees. Let me pick this stuff up. We need to grab some Nook Miles tickets and head out and pick up some palm trees. Left us hanging on city folk for seven years for horizons. <laughs> but <heads. laughs> I don't think it'll be another seven years. And then, you know, and it, it, the wait between, what's it called? Um, city folk and New Horizons makes sense when you consider how, like, niche a game Animal Crossing is or was. But now everybody knows about it. They would be stupid. Not to be making something right now. And I'm sure they are. But it's not going to be an update to this game. I'm talking like they're making another Animal Crossing right now. And hopefully it's in space. Right? That's what we all... We've all collectively decided it's Animal Crossing in space, right? N newer Horizons. Last Horizon. Final Frontier. What am I looking for? Tickets. That's what I'm looking for. The gap between New Leaf and New Horizons was due to the failure of the Wii U. Yeah, you're right. I actually bought a Wii U because I was anticipating Animal Crossing on it like an idiot. <laughs> and yeah, I didn't uh, did not get Animal Crossing on it. All right, let's head out. Then this one becomes obsolete. Yeah, I mean, that's okay, though. I, New Leaf is hot obsolete, but uh, I was just playing that the other day. I'm going to fly. Animal Crossing in first person. You know, I did a video where I played a game that was clearly inspired by, you know, an Animal Crossing-like game. I don't know if it was inspired directly by Animal Crossing, but... It was in VR, and I, I it's on the channel. It's one of my more recent long-form videos. And uh, didn't didn't get the views I wanted it to get, but it was fun. 
And if you want, if you want to experience what a game like Animal Crossing would look like in uh, in that environment, I recommend it. I also made sure to have it edited in such a way where it wouldn't make you motion sick. So a lot of the stuff that's happening on the screen is kind of me standing in one place, and then you know it cuts and I'm somewhere else. So I'm not I'm not like moving around so much where you're gonna get sick. Some people commented that VR they you know they were worried that <laughs> about watching the video because they're afraid it was gonna make them sick. Which is fair. What game is it again? Sounds fun. Oh, what was that game called? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> but it, it has a name. And it's not Animal Crossing in VR. Yeah, Captain Tours can have bushes, but these can't. I'm just trying to get the uh, palm trees. I'll find it on your channel later. Um, let's see, what, uh, what did I miss here? I appreciate the effort to cut out motion sickness inducing views. I'm easily triggered myself. I, I didn't think I got motion sickness until I started messing around with VR and I played No Man's Sky and, uh, that lasted all of five minutes. Any game that doesn't support movement via like teleporting and they want you to use a joystick to make your character walk that's gonna make me sick because i'm not moving my legs but my body feels like it's moving forward because i'm pushing the joystick forward so yeah <laughs> motion sickness can also develop as you get older i never had it when i was younger uh, around my um, Kate twenties started to kick in. Interesting. It's still it's the only instance where I've gotten motion sickness. I, I haven't been able to replicate that doing anything else, so it's kind of interesting. Okay, let's see. Garden of the Sea. Oh, that's the game. Yep. Anyway, bookmark that for later because it was a lot of fun to make and it also took forever. All right, where are we going? I wanted him to just take me to another island. For some reason, I just assumed he was going to whisk me off to another island, but nope. He's going to make me go home first. And I'm like, oh yeah. Yeah, that's a feature I want, not a feature that exists. One more round of that should give us enough palm trees to cover us for a bit. All right, Lemon. We'll see you later. Fly. Go. Only got motion sickness from a rhythm game? Oh. Yeah, the only the only rhythm game I've played on uh, theirs on VR is Beat Saber. Speaking of rhythm games, anyone here tried Trombone Champ? I'm not very good at it, but it sure is hilarious. At least join late. That's okay. How's it going? We're just gathering up some uh, palm trees for our beaches. I get motion sick easy, so I like games that give you options to play in VR or not. Yeah, I, I, I get that. I'm absolutely terrible at trombone champ, and I love it. <laughs> I'm awful at rhythm games. <laughs> yeah, rhythm games are... Uh, I, I don't know. I'm, I'm one of those that kind of plays them and plays them and I actually get, I start to get pretty good but then I get bored of it and then I stop and then I try to pick it up again and I have to, you know, start all over relearning everything.
Just when I'm getting good. I'm like, okay, I've had enough. It's fear of success. That's what it is. I'm afraid that I'll get so good, I, I'll be able to compete at a professional level, and I'll win millions of dollars being good at Beat Saber, but I can't bring myself to do it. Mm -hmm. All right, what do we got? I think that's plenty of palm trees. We also got a free recipe. What's this? Oh, cool. I can't pronounce it, but it's mine. What is this thing? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at that. It's one of those uh, yeah, nesting dolls. Yeah. Going to check out the Dinkum Christmas update once your island is done. Uh, I guess we should make that a thing. Yeah, over the holiday, right? We should probably plan on that. Only did the easy levels have 100% accuracy. Oh, you used to play rhythm games before you got an Animal Crossing. Gotcha. Must head out 1 a.m. here. Promise to do Christmas crafts and decorate the tree tomorrow with the kids. Nice. AJ, we'll see you later. Thanks for hanging out. I'll watch the rest of the coffee in the morning. Why would you ruin your coffee like that? Can't, don't you want to enjoy your coffee? I play rhythm games, but they're K-pop related, and they're from this company called Dolcom Soft. I yeah, I, I wouldn't I wouldn't be familiar. But uh, yeah, I guess there's way more rhythm games out there than I had uh, anticipated. Are you almost done with this gold core nightmare? Yes, almost. Almost. We're finishing it today, one way or another. I have to because I'm uploading it tomorrow. I'm uploading it tomorrow, and this is it. This is truly, truly, truly it. It has to be. There's no other option. End of an era. Yes, a very long, gold-laden era. Now, we're still going to be on the island. Like, when I do dream streams and stuff, we're still using this island. It's not necessarily going anywhere. It's kind of like, you know, that World of Warcraft episode of South Park. We're going to finish, and we can go, okay, now what? Well, now we can play the game. Like, I, I can finally start to work on the uh, the museum, maybe? I don't know. I can maybe play Animal Crossing. That might be fun. Might that Maybe that's the next thing I do. Everyone's like, what are you going to do next? I don't know. Play Animal Crossing. <laughs> maybe I'll actually play the game. Tomorrow's the last day of fall, too, and Animal Crossing, so it's perfect timing. I Yeah, someone was trying to warn me, and I don't know if they're right or not, but it sounds right. So the snow settles on the 11th, correct? But someone was trying to warn me that it's actually going to be snowing on the 10th. Like, snow will be falling down. And I was thinking about it. And I thought, well, dang. If that's true, what a gold core thing to do if you're me. Right? Like, how many people have, like, islands that are this extravagant uploaded on such a perfect day where, where, it's, where it's heavy snowfall, but there's not snow stuck to the ground yet? That's pretty gold core, if you ask me. It's pretty awesome. The The ground is just crispy looking enough to where the, the path pops out really nice, the gold path. It's, it's I'm, I gotta say, I'm, I'm actually pretty excited for all of you to get to come visit such a unique dream island. We are just gonna pepper this thing with palm trees. This is a lot of palm trees. I do not have this many palm trees. I think we have to go get more. Well, they're zigging, they're zagging. Maybe they stop there for a minute. Look at this. Should I really put this many? Probably not. Let's put, let's actually move this one up here. Kylena, we'll see you later. Okay. Maybe this one comes down here. This is a lot. This is a lot of trees, but uh, yeah, we'll, we'll do it. We do not have this many trees. We have to go back out. Hope you're having a wonderful week. Join the stream a bit late. Brianna, how's it going? Um, or is it Brianna? Maybe it's Brianna. How are you? Uh, yes, everything is, everything is good. We're... We're doing all the finishing touches on our Gold Core Island. This is just the last minute stuff before we upload the dream address and make it public tomorrow. So I am super excited. I have to go out and grab me some more palms. 
I decided I'm not going to overdo the beaches because I don't have the time. So this is my solution, is to just plant these palm trees. We also probably need to go and shake all of them. Get all the get all the coconuts off because we have our arena and we've determined that if people fill up their bellies and then do the arena, they'll basically be cheating themselves. So I want to try and remove all the all the food temptations there. But it's also a good opportunity for me to take out a flimsy axe and like and chop up some some trees to get some wood. That'll be nice. Let's head out. It's weird to go to these islands and not hunt for a villager. It feels so lonely. Like when you when you're doing this for a villager hunt, you know there's gonna be people waiting for you on the other side. That's like kind of exciting. There's like this anticipation, but now I know I'm just going to some random deserted island. I kind of feel like, why didn't they just let villagers hang out, even if you can't invite them to your island? I think they should still be invitable. I think it should be kind of similar to the campsite. You can go to these random islands, and you can always villager hunt, and you don't need a plot open. And then, if you see somebody you like, you can just invite them to live on your island. And it'll be like, oh, I, I, you know, I gave Tom Nook a call because cell phones, right? They don't have to go into resident services. They can just give Tom Nook a phone call. And he's like, oh, no can do. There's, there's no plots left. But he did say that so-and-so wants to leave. And then you get to choose whether or not you want to do that. And I think that would be better than the amiibo thing because the amiibos, like, that's kind of special, right? Like, I still think the amiibos should be the only way you can you can choose who to kick out um if again if they even need to be i think it's a uh, it's a feature that sells amiibos so from a marketing standpoint i get why nintendo kind of blocked off that ability um unless you buy amiibos but for the ultimate customizations yeah we should always be able to choose exactly who stays and who goes crusader are we slaying uh yeah we're, we're getting it done this is happening. We are conquering this video game right now. I think there's only four trees per uh, per island we go to. So we'll grab this one over here, and then we'll go to one more island, and that'll be eight trees. Been hunting for Judy and Anka for five days now. Oh my gosh! I wish you luck. I will say, I'm not necessarily complaining, by the way, about the villager hunting we have, because we didn't have that in previous games, and it's such a nice feature. It's so nice being able to have at least some kind of choice as to who moves on your island, and uh, it's not just some rando that moves in. I think it's a better way to build a relationship with the villagers, too. Like, once you find that one you're looking for, it's really exciting, and, uh, you know, inviting them to, to come live in your empty plot, like, all that stuff is awesome. I just think, again, like everything in this game, there's always, like, one step further they could take it if they wanted to. I'm kind of hoping the next Animal Crossing game is like the next Sims game. And I say that assuming that maybe you've seen some footage of the next Sims game. <laughs> um, basically, the Sims, there, there's this game called Paralives. And it's, it's, everyone's looking at it as, like, the Sims, like, big competition. And Paralives is doing some really, really unique things with, with furniture and uh, and design in the game, like building design and furniture design. You can actually take like pillows and stuff and resize them to any size you want, and like you can really make you can take a piece of furniture and make it fit exactly the space you want it. It's insane the controls and stuff that you're gonna get. Well, Paralives hasn't come out yet. <laughs> it's been a very long time since people have known this was in the works. And uh, unfortunately for that team, and hopefully they, they can figure this out, um, Maxis, who makes The Sims, has jumped all over that idea. So the next Sims game, they showed a little bit of footage, and it's going to have those types of features. 
so it's it's kind of like taking The Sims as you know it now and completely cranking it to a thousand. Like everything you couldn't do before, you're going to be able to do in the next Sims game, from the looks of it. And I'm hoping Animal Crossing, whatever comes next, is the same way. I'm hoping they they take the game and they just crank it to eleven. They take everyone's suggestions and more, and they're like, okay, you guys want the ultimate Nintendo design sim? Here you flip and go. And I want them to just blow our minds. That's what I'm hoping for. In front of the villagers, you had uh, low friendship with, you kept that old mechanic, and just pieced out without warning, a little realism. I, I gotta say, that pieced out without realism thing that was in New Leaf is why I stopped playing New Leaf. I would have played New Leaf for probably another year straight if those villagers hadn't ruined, completely ruined my island. But they did. Because not only do they leave without warning, but someone else moves in, whether you want them to or not. That spot is filling up. And guess what? It's not a spot you get to predict. The villagers move in wherever. So if you have paths down, if you're trying to plant some hybrids and you're, you're, finally, you're finally getting those hybrid flowers you want, there's a really good chance someone's house can come along one day and crush everything you've been doing. Physically crush it. And that is the worst. Oh my gosh. Is that the worst feeling ever? You made another one? Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Crystal. I will, uh, I will take a look for it when we get back to the island. Crush the flowers along with your dreams. It, it's not just the flowers. It's your paths. Like, you're so... If you're like me and you you designed a very specific layout to your town, unfortunately, based off the houses where you didn't get to place them, right? Like, all the houses in the game just go somewhere random. So I made paths to everyone's houses. I had it all broken out. It was awesome. And then people left and came back. Because I took a short break. I couldn't stop them from leaving. They, I came back. Someone was missing. Someone new had moved in. And they, they ruined everything. So I, I stopped playing. I'm like, no, I worked way too hard on that. I'm not. I'm done. I'm done. So, I'm playing it again, but now I kind of know what I'm up against. So I'm not. I'm just. I'm just not going to do path layout like that anymore. <laughs> but at the time, it was pretty soul crushing. Lily just joined. How's it going? Welcome to those just joining. We are wrapping up our gold core island, doing the last finishing touches. We have to finish it today, no matter what. And uh, right now I'm just looking up a, a design code here. V, F, G, 9, V, R, W, S, 60, Y, N. All right, what do we got? Oh, wow. I love this. <laughs> Soon. Yes. Thank you. What a great sign. I'm running out of space now, though. <laughs> but that's okay. That Yes, that is a perfect sign. We got to find somewhere to hide this on the island. How am I? Okay, we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Let's pick up the stuff at the entrance before I forget and then upload my dream address with garbage on the ground. That'll make me sad. Okay. Perfect. We gotta plant down these trees. I'm glad my holes stayed down. That's pretty cool. I don't have to like think about where I wanted the trees. I can just put them right where I had planned. Big 
There it is. Uh, it does feel like we need another one somewhere in here, doesn't it? I'm trying to decide where. Should it go here? Uh, that would make it harder to walk. I don't know. Maybe in, maybe in, in here. Actually, that's way too, like, perfectly angled now. There's three trees in a row that are just all lined up. I don't like that. Should it go maybe out here? Is that even possible? Probably not, right? Right there. Yes. Okay, that's good. Cool. Nice, thick layers of trees. Then we have this area down here. I got three more trees, but this is going to be a volleyball area. So we're not, we're not going to need too many more trees. I'm happy to just use three. And then we have our lilies of the valley that we're keeping here just in case. Uh, in case we want to, like, use them somewhere. So I'm thinking, like... Well, no. Maybe we do them like that. It makes me so happy anytime a creator likes one of my designs enough to put it on their island. If you put it on your island, I'm coming to find it. <laughs> that one for sure. I want to put the other one somewhere as well, but I'm not sure where. But yeah, we will. We need to find room for that other one. Thank you for your designs. That was fun. Okay. Yep, having these trees here is nice. It still makes me wonder if I should put something over here. Like, we got this big rock and stuff. I don't know what to do with it. I'm kind of just happy to leave it alone. And and this will still feel finished enough to me. But if, if something jumps out at us, maybe we'll do it. Is that enough room for all of these lilies? I don't think it is. Can I fit this one right here? I doubt it. Nope. So these are going to go up on our cliffs with a few other things. There's a whole other cliff area that I want to figure out. How many more? Uh, four? Okay. I don't know why I'm filling up on these. I have other items I have to hold. Okay, we'll call that there. All right. Let me hit up my storage. And then let's go up into the cliffs and start putting down a few of these uh, flowers. I can feel it. We're really close. We are very, very close to being done. So when I'm talking about the cliffs, I'm talking about up here. Uh, these are the cliffs. So I've put all of my rocks up here. My actual, like, you know, respawnable rocks. And now I want to decorate around them. Uh, it's okay if they're not fully functional. Meaning, if I, ha if I go to smash them and things don't uh, have enough room to fall around them, that's fine. I'd kind of rather it look good. Let's try one of the lilies back here. That's pretty nice. Let's try one right here. Uh, I don't like both of them up here. I know it's a weird thing, but... I think I like the one in the front better. Something should go right in this spot, but it's not that. 
Will, the, will you let the oinkoids on the beach roam free? Yeah, they're they're free range oinkoids. Grass fed and all that. I started putting more rocks up here. It just kind of looks funky now. <laughs> now that all the rocks are in place, I'm like, huh. I don't know if I like this. It's fine for now, I guess. I'll place that there. You can tell I've already, I've kind of already been up here with these. I placed a few down already. And we even have a couple gold roses up here. Perhaps we do a gold rose in this spot. Okay. Should I do a tree? Oh, I can't. I don't have any. I don't have any trees because I can't grow them. <sighs> I was thinking one of these. I have a money tree, but I normally don't put them this high. But I could put a money tree. Can you put a tree this close to a rock? No. All right. Well, that settles that. Hmm. Okay. Well, let's head down here. I'm going to put a gold rose probably right here. You can tell I've also been doing some work back here as well. So we got a few of those little bricks at the top, some other flowers, a couple gold roses here and there. I think we could put another lily right in there, just, just kind of tucked in, you know? Maybe a gold rose in this spot. Okay, all right. I'm trying not to overdo it. Just, just a few things. And the rest of it, we need to just get little knickknacks. Cliff knacks. Cliff knickknacks. Like, I have the spot right here, so we can also put down s stuff if we want. Maybe it should actually go right here. I like the vase here, and I like this here. It feels like something else should be in between them, and I don't know what. But we'll, we'll just leave it for now. Um, like the island. Got in your class. Thank you so much. I like it, too. I think it's turned out pretty nice. Maybe stick a lily right there. Nope, we can't. Okay, that's fine. I didn't want to anyway. Oh. Uh, oh, I put it away already. I thought it'd be fun to put the... There's a wrestling figurine I have. And I wanted to put him somewhere. Fart jar. There's enough fart jars over there already. But I thought I thought the wrestling figurine would be cool somewhere in here. I'm not sure where I'd put it now. Maybe we put a lily right here. That's kind of nice. Something else should go right here under this tree. So we'll figure that out once we get into knick-knack mode. <laughs> Did someone mention fart jar? No. Nobody's talking about farts. Uh, what I wanted to do outside Joey's house was put like a little counter with some decoy ducks on it, as if to as if to imply that he uh, he makes them. I might still do that. 
But we can also come down here and put a lily. You might be asking, why are you using Lily of the Valley on a gold core island when you could use gold roses? It's because you only get these if your island is, is real purdy. So I just thought, in their own right, they're a pretty gold core kind of flower. I just realized I don't necessarily love it there. But digging it up now would take so much effort that I don't care to move it. So I'm just going to... Should I? It wouldn't actually be too bad. I'll move it. So the one gold core item that isn't gold. There's a few, but yeah. They're definitely one of them. Oops. I don't like it back here because it's too short. It goes with every island. It does. There. Fixed. Problem solved. Something taller could go in there, though. I am tinkering around with lilies, but this is the next area we're about to work on. It's Egbert's Farmer's Market. I'll probably need, I, well, I'll probably need another stall, but I have to settle for this one because I don't have a lot of materials at the moment. Yeah, Wisp is here. I'm not going to interact with Wisp because I kind of hate him in this game. <laughs> Wisp is kind of annoying, so I'm just going to let let him hang. I'm not, I'm not going to mess with that. Do we want one up there, maybe? You're just like up where? Uh, let's see. Is there even a way for me to get on this cliff anymore? I think I've made it sufficiently uh, filled in, didn't I? All right. Uh, okay, we can figure this out. Here we go. <laughs> I still can't climb it. <laughs> it's too it's too full of stuff. All right. No, it's fine. It's got plenty of things. Edu, we'll see you later. Have a good one. Oops. I have some stalls if you want more. I'm not using them. Um, that's all right. I, I do need to chop up some trees anyway. So I should be, in the end, I should be okay. But thank you. I think we get into knick-knack mode. Yeah, there's not, there's not much I can do with cliff edges at this point uh, without placing little items here and there. Oh, unless we want to do, let's see. We can put one here. I did want more stuff along this path, so that's that's good there. What's going on here? Oh, okay. Okay, good. Bubblicious, how's it going? All right, head back to our storage area. Done. We need stuff and things. Nick Nax. Start at the top. And we will find some items we can place in our clips. What do we got? So, um, it probably wouldn't hurt to keep these two on us. They, you know, they probably go good up there on the cliffs. 
I have these hammocks. Paradise planning hammocks are pretty uh, gold core, if you ask me. I think one could go somewhere. I don't know. I also have a hay bed. Where could I put that? Eh, I don't know. Oh, Egbert. We gotta work on Egbert's place, yeah. Okay. What else? These are all kind of larger items. Okay. Oh, I forgot the toilet in the arena. That's right. What time of day will you upload your dream address? I'm thinking it's going to be uh, 5 p.m. in the game. I think 5 p.m. I like that 5 p.m. music the best. And it's probably going to be snowing tomorrow, but that would normally be the golden hour. So I thought that would be like the best time to do it originally. I'm going to stick to that plan, even though it's probably not going to look very golden out at that point. Unless if I'm playing early and it's getting too dark, I might just go ahead and uh, upload it sooner than that. But yeah, if at 4 o'clock, I'm like, oh, I don't know. I don't think 5 o'clock is going to be very bright. Then I'll just go ahead and upload it. But I don't think it gets super dark at 5. Make sure you don't make it at 5 a.m. Bobby Man, how's it going? Um, still looking for some cliff knacks. What do we got? What do we got? More, more of these, probably. Okay. We're, we're down to the small items now. We might have to start crafting. Oh, these candles are nice. Even though they're not... They're not like these golden candlesticks. They're still pretty nice. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. A uh, stack of cash. Yep. This is that wrestling figurine I was talking about, but it, I don't think it fits over there. I wanted it to. It's been a crazy day. Grateful to get to wind down and chill with y'all. Megorium, welcome. Sorry about your crazy day. I've had a crazy week. Um, so I, I feel that. Golden fish. Golden urn. This is what we need. I gotta I gotta start just crafting gold stuff. Do you need anything to finish your island? Uh, no, thank you though. I'm good. We are we are just grabbing some stuff out of my storage for the finishing touches, and uh, as you can see, I've I've grabbed myself quite a few, <laughs> quite a few things. We're gonna head back. Oh, you know what? Should something go over here? Actually, I think this is fine. It's a narrow little area. I do think something should go right here, and uh, you know what I had for a little while was that easel and, and someone was like why is there an easel it's because i meant to place a mannequin for the rock area we were doing and i accidentally picked easel instead but i mean what if you know <laughs> can i even get out of here okay I, it's not that I don't like this here. It's just that I kind of think I should put this somewhere else that's a little more creepy. It should be kind of hiding somewhere. Like, you should happen upon it, and you're like, what? But this is in plain sight, so I'm, I'm, not, I'm not sure. I think we should put something else here, though. Like, I like the easel. Could there be a different design that we, we plop here? So we have all these. 
And it could just be that Mahalo design. I don't think there's anything else down here that I would necessarily want to, like, put down. By the Rusty Beach could be good. Yeah. That's something. Are you going to leave gifts for dreamers? Uh, I'm actually doing a few things. There's going to be an arena where you can... The, <laughs> the dog painting. Uh, there's an arena where you can participate in a uh, an obstacle course. And then there's going to be a gold nugget scavenger hunt. Lots of annoying press. Oh, you mean like physically like wrapped gifts. Um, I hadn't considered it. But maybe... Oh man, that's yeah, that's not a bad idea. What do we think of the Mahalo crest just kind of plopped here for no reason? Should I move it? Should I do that? Oh, that's kind of weird. I don't know. Soon worked better over there, but I don't necessarily want that one over there. All right, well, let's put some stuff down over here. Uh, so I think maybe a a mushroom. Or the glowing moss, I guess. Let me try the mushroom. Okay. Right? Probably. Something. Mushroom lamp. What do we think of going the mushroom route? Lizzie, how's it going? Do we like this? Should I should I swap them? Let's swap them. Let's put the mushroom lamp back here. Just got the game pretty fun so far. How's the island coming along? Oh, I'm glad you got it. Um, it's it's coming along pretty nice. Things are good. Uh oh, you know what? The hammock was something I was considering trying up here just because we would have the room. It doesn't look too terrible there, but you wouldn't necessarily put a hammock right next to a giant boulder. It just feels irresponsible, like you're going to get hurt. I'll keep that away for now. All right, so we're swapping these around. Hmm. Gold candlesticks on the mushroom, maybe? Let's see. So here's the regular candle. It looks kind of funny. I'm thinking gold candlestick, though. Right? <laughs> I don't know. I'm not crazy about it. The more I look at it, the more I'm like, eh. I don't know what to do. Hmm. Yeah, the height is kind of weird. The little holding lanterns? Yeah, those are good too. I, I don't have any extra ones of those. But those are a really good item. And they come in gold. What if we put the mushroom by the tree? I actually think that might look better, like crowding it right here. Maybe maybe out a little bit. Oh, you know what? I want it 
Let me try this. Can I push it up? And then somehow get it closer to the tree? Is that possible? Dang it. Here, let me just try to see if I can squeeze it in there more. No, 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 no. I want you to go by the rock. I can push the rock back and then probably fit the mushroom. But I like the rock up here. Okay. That's what I want. Okay, perfect. Okay. I think that's pretty good. So... It looks a little bit barren right here. It's kind of weird that there's nothing on the ground at all. So I could do a very little bit of our design tiles that we've been using everywhere else. Just just a little tiny bit. And, and then at least it'll look like there's something on the ground. Uh, we want to come back with that more. So right here. Okay. You know what I want to do actually is uh, I want to use this one. And if possible, I wanted to use this, but I don't know if that's, no, nope, that'll work. Okay, good. Okay, did not mean that. Okay, we'll use that corner piece there. Uh, I'm going to use, actually, I'm going to use this piece right here. Okay. Nope. It's a very careful art. There we go. Yes. So that's all it needed. It just just needed a little something. That's pretty good. My concern is I'm gonna have to do that all on the top of these cliffs here. <laughs> but it gives the it gives it that finished look it needs, you know. Not having anything in those big empty spots looks so weird. It's kind of why I'm, I'm struggling with my arena. Like I don't love the arena. And I think that's that's it right there. It just doesn't have any kind of little designs at all. So I kind of wonder if we should just embrace that right now and just start with this whole top section here. Just really put those designs down. I don't know. Is that what I should do? Should I just grab some of these designs and start you know, putting them everywhere. <laughs> let's let's begin. I'm just gonna try and do this logically, so I'm not constantly switching the designs. I'm still gonna end up constantly switching the designs, but maybe there's hope. Put those there. Use this one as well. Right here? Okay. And yeah, throughout here we don't have a whole lot of room, so we have to get creative. Okay. Well. Will that work? I don't think that'll really work. I haven't watched one of your streams in so long. Happy to be back. Elfie, how's it going? Welcome. I guess we're going to be switching designs quite a bit. We'll we'll try to be as smart about this as we can. So, corner pieces, right? I'm going to need 
one there. Come through here. Uh, this whole thing is probably going to be connected in some way. We'll definitely need a corner right here. What about the top and bottom chunks? We'll want one here. I don't think I want one here because I think we're going to connect these two. Yeah, Sahar is walking around today. Uh, no matter what I do, I'm just going to need to constantly do a design and switch it. I I, I think for me, this is going to go faster if I do it this way. It's annoying, but it's true. Put that there. All right. I love these little, these two right here are great because you can just like cap off little parts of it. Just like that. Okay. All right, so we have this. And this. Okay, this is this is gonna work. Do we have yep, okay, good. I was gonna say, do we have one that just goes straight up? We do. So we'll use it like that. And then I think we would probably start to do something like this. that. I don't find it annoying. I enjoy watching the creating. Well, thank you. I, I, I'm, maybe annoying was the wrong word. There's just a, an amount of tedium to this. That's all. Okay. Let's see. Keep going here. Am I planning to do more dinkum? Uh, yeah, I am. I am. This is looking pretty good. I like having these here, these bricks. Let's see. Uh, let's let's cap that off like that. Maybe pop a gold rose down now, right here. Oh, that looks nice. 103 people like the tedium. Well, 73 people like the tedium. Carly, how's it going? Welcome. All right. And I think we can also put down... I think these ones are my favorite because they just they stand on their own. Let's put that like that. That's pretty good. All right. And let's continue. We're going to go around this tree... Like this. Yes, look at us go. Here we go. Check that out. Look at me traverse that tree. That tree didn't even know what the heck to do. I think I'm, I'm bobbing and I'm going to weave. Look at that. That tree is shook. Perfect. Okay, this is good. And now we're intersecting one of the parts we had planned up here. Which is great. That'll be just like that. Curve up like this. Okay. 
Okay. Yep. This is looking good. The only thing... I don't know. Do I choose the right... Do I choose the right tile for this spot here? I mean, kind of not. Yeah, I kind of messed up. Uh, let's let's put. It's actually supposed to be a solid brick piece. Yeah, and then this one. Okay, there we go. There we go. And then we want this one up here. And just for funsies, we'll take this tiny little. Where'd it go? This one. And we'll put it right here. Okay. So now we just got to connect this thing, and I think that's enough of our bricks up top. Uh, well, I mean, okay, hold on. We can use this one again behind this tree. Okay. And, yeah, just, just kind of wrap it around the tree a little bit, like that. Which piece should go there now? I actually think we need to use more of these solid ones. Not that. Carly, we'll see you later. Okay, just like that. Uh, I guess we need another one, right? Yeah, yeah we do. Mm -hmm. And one there. Okay, I think for the bricks we did it. Yay. Excellent. Just adding a couple more little accents here. Design blends with the grass. Isn't that great? Yeah, this is like the perfect design for the color of the grass right now. It's subtle, but it may, uh, makes the cliff tops look a lot better, a lot more finished, intentional. Um, oh, I did miss one spot, though. I, I just noticed it. Okay, there we go. I was going to say, if I, if I upload this island with a mistake like that and I find out about it, I'm just going to be crushed. Okay, so this is looking better, and now I'm thinking we can we can place down some more rocks and stuff, and it's going to look a lot nicer. Like the garden rock. Kind of shove that there. And we also have that, where's that flat rock? Uh, no, I want it in front of the garden rock, like between these two here. Yeah. Sorta. Yeah, 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 kinda, kinda like that. Yeah, it just makes it look like something. <laughs> Sorry, popping in and out, out of the loop. Uh, how much more is there to be done? Uh, if you're not sure, it's okay. Um, we're almost there. So I said we needed to do Egbert's house next, and then I got distracted by these cliffs. They, they ended up being more work than I had anticipated. But Egbert's house is after this, and then I think we're gonna just going to do a quick overview of everything. Just make sure it's all good to go, good for upload. So we're almost there. I'm trying to find some knickknacks to put on these cliffs, though. And it doesn't need to be chock full of stuff. It just, I just want some things up here. 
Uh, our paradise planting hammock, there's actually enough room to put it up here. And I think this could be kind of nice. And of course I lost it. Right here. As long as we can still walk around it, which we can. Um, I think it kind of works there. Right? Does it? Which side is... Uh, I want to turn it around. Uh, <laughs> okay. All right. Push that there. Uh, yeah. Okay. I like that. What else? What else? What else? Uh, golden vase, scooter. Pile of cash, gold turtle. So maybe a pile of cash up here. Oh. Drat. That's not where that fits. Try again. Okay. Squeeze in there. Come on, you can do it. Oh, come on. You let me squeeze back here every other time. Here we go. That's what I wanted, right on the edge of the cliff. Pile of cash. Okay, that's pretty good. And then over here, I'm thinking the gold candlestick. Should it maybe turn this way? Uh, I don't know. What if we put the other candle right here, actually? This one. Let's do that. That looks pretty good. But before we do, I feel like we need to put an item right in here. Could we put the... Turtle. Okay, Turtle, you were so close, and yet so far. Let's try that again from the top. Question, are you actually going to delete the island? We're going to try not to. The, the goal, if we don't finish tonight, I pretty much might as well. But, yeah, my goal is to not. This is this is how we fix this. We we just need to manipulate the water. <laughs> and that way we can push the turtle exactly where we want it, and then we can put the water back where we had it. So that That is where I wanted the turtle. Which was gonna be really hard to get right if we didn't get rid of the water. How about the scooter? So the scooter I actually have a special spot for. I'm holding on to it for now. Okay, and then the candle can go right here. There we go. That's what I needed. All right. Golden vase. It's probably over. Probably overdue for one. Kind of wondering if I should put it down there. Uh, where that gold rose is, and then bring the gold rose in front of it or something. I know I need stuff for up where I'm standing right now, but that gold vase would tuck into this spot really nice, I think. Okay. So yeah, we can put that there. And will a gold rose still look good? Oops. Why can't I plant things? What? <laughs> it doesn't let me 
plant the gold rose. One more try. Okay, that's fine. Sure. We'll just put it right here. Oh, we can't. I put bricks there. All right. I'll get rid of the bricks. Yeah. Okay, that's pretty good. Why would you spend a half... A, why would you spend a... Hey, what is that, a year and a half, you mean, on the island to delete it? I know, right? That would be pretty crazy. So we better finish. Glowing my stool. Okay, wait, wait a minute. I have another one of these candles. I didn't know that. We also have the golden urn. Which could go in a couple of spots. Maybe it goes right up here. Yeah, I think that's pretty good. Something should go right here where I'm standing. I remember when you first announced you're doing gold core. That was a long time ago now. Hmm. What do we think? We probably need some more stuff, right? Is it is it time to start crafting? It's probably time to start crafting. Let's let's start crafting some things. We need some more options. Where do you think you're going? We have an intruder. That was close. There we go. Thick stripes shirt. Oh my gosh. That was a waste. Your stomach hurts a little. Ate too much cheese tortellini. Uh, is there such a thing, though? Can't get something out. What are we getting out? Gold, right? Gold nuggets? Probably gold nuggets. And we want to see what we can craft here. All right, so I'm thinking gold bars. Just a handful. It's good to just litter your gold core island with these. I mean, I don't have like a lot of stuff. I mean, maybe put more gold dung beetles. We don't use those a lot. Let's craft just a couple of those. I got the casket as well. I think that's out of these items. I think that's good. Is there anything else that I'm not seeing that's simply not craftable? What if we did another bunch of these, the yellow leaf piles? Those are just a great item. When you're trying to decorate like I am right now, we're just junking stuff up. I think these are fantastic. So acorns and clumps of weeds. Acorns and clumps of weeds. Mm. 
Okay. I don't know if I have any pine cone recipes, but I have five pine cones. Maybe it's something is in there that I've been missing. Okay. Keep it going. Alright, I think this might be enough piles of, uh, piles of leaves there. And then let me just look and see what other craftables are currently craftable. The Turkey Day Wheat Decor is currently craftable, but I don't know. And then what's this? Pile, I have a brown pile of leaves? Oh, that's the pine cone doing that. Okay. I'm going to stick with the gold ones. And that's probably good for now. Okay. Let's put some of these items away. And head back up to the cliffs. And while we do this, I should probably let you know that uh, down in the description below, Tom Nook here, he has some things. He has some things he wants to tell you about. You see... I don't know if you know a lot about Tom Nook, but he's kind of a capitalist scumbag. He's just way into you spending your money on things, you know, that you don't need, or in this case for gifts that your friends honestly don't need. Things like copies of Animal Crossing, which are on sale right now. And that's kind of cool, right? You know, if, if your friend is working on their second island and they're almost done and you want to get them another copy of the game... And a Nintendo Switch to go with it, you know, so they can work on their third island. You have that as an option. And once you do that, you'll probably want to get them an SD card. Maybe a big one. Um, this is on sale. And this is even cheaper than the last time we saw it, says Tom Nook. So that's that's pretty uh, generous of him to be offering such generous sales right now for the holidays. And, of course, if you don't like technology but your friends love collecting, uh, you know, stuffed animals... Squishmallows. You can get a Squishmallow mystery box sent to one of your friends. Send them five for, at that price. Why not? Right? Not only do you get your holiday shopping out of the way, you get to satiate Tom Nook's constant quest for your money. And you support this channel, which is kind of cool too. So, yeah, just wanted to point that out. There's some links down below. He's such a con artist. Make me pay so many bells. I know. He's kind of gross, but he paid a lot of money for the, uh, the, you know, the advertising space here on the channel, so I, I can't really do anything about it. I apologize. Um, here we go. Should the leaf pile be here? I never know where... I, I don't know. Maybe the leaf pile should be up on this more thinned out kind of section. Like right here-ish? Maybe, right? I kind of want it on this side. Yeah, that looks better. Fixing my Jalen Squishmallow I bought from earlier today. <laughs> there you go. Maybe another leaf pile next to the hammock. We did craft a lot of them. I think we did. Here we go. That's a little too close. Uh, try again. Dang it. I always lose everything. Uh, right here. No! Where are you going? Leaf piles. Stop it. You know what I want. That. That's what I want. And then a pile of gold bars pile of gold bars right here. It's pretty cool. Maybe another one right here. Why not? 
not gold bars, but something else down here. Uh, could be the dung beetle. Oh, was it the fish? Uh, try again, try again. Okay. Nook is the ultimate slumlord. Here's a house you'll be paying for the rest of your life. You'll be paying for it for the rest of your life. It looks fishy there. Sorry, I had to find the button. <sighs> yes, it does. Yes, it does, I suppose. Gold rose, my last gold rose. We could put that right here, perhaps. Helps that look a little more complete. Aiden, how's it going? How are you? Hay bed, candlestick, gold bars, gold base, scooter. Uh, what if we put a candlestick by the fish? I just feel like we, we group a couple items together here. I feel like that candlestick can move over one space. Let's try it. Yep. Yeah, I think it can. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I'd say that's pretty good. So we got our rocks. We got a couple little items up here, but nothing nothing too fancy. We're okay. Just solid bricks of gold. And uh, we got a hammock hidden up here for, for hanging out. Yeah, we got Wisp creeping around, which is unfortunate. We're ready to move on to uh, this last hunk of cliff here. I haven't dropped in, in here in a while. I've been playing so many games. That's good, though. What are you playing? And I've always wondered what should go in this spot right here. Like, by the museum. I have a big fossil on the other side. Like, something cool could go here. While we think about that, I'm going to put my scooter where I've been considering having it. I've been thinking about this for a long time. But I thought it'd be nice to have a third scooter for this little uh, scooter display that I have. And it doesn't fit. Hmm. Now I know this fits. Put that there. Try again. Perfect. Yeah. That's all I wanted. A little uh, scooter gang. Dinosaur fossils? I already have a really big fossil right here. Harvestella? Have not played that. Modern Warfare 2, Splatoon 3, Team Fortress 2, Halo Infinite Master Chief Collection, Forza 5, maybe even more. Nice. Nice collection of games. Could do another gold vase. Uh, we do. We could do it kind of behind the cliff a little bit. So I'm thinking kind of like... Not, not that, not that. Where'd it go? Here. You just beat it. Did you enjoy it? So yeah, gold vase there. Maybe an altar? I don't know. I keep using altars, but I don't know what to put on top of them. <laughs> maybe a fossil. Uh, maybe we can put an altar up here and, and shove a fossil on top of it. That could be fun. Uh, how do we craft the altar? Oh, we need the... Right, we need stone to craft a, a non-gold -go altar. What first got you into Animal Crossing? Um, I wanted... I don't know. I, I think I didn't... Th th at the time, because I played the GameCube one first, at the time, cozy game was not part of my vocabulary. But that's exactly what I wanted. I just, I really loved video games, but I played a lot of the ones that were just listed, in fact, 
like Halo and, and Call of Duty, things like that. But I was kind of just, sometimes I just wanted a break from games that made me mad because they were, it seemed like the only games that my friends would play and I would play were online competitive games that made me really excited and then anxious and then angry. <laughs> so, you know, I, I learned about Animal Crossing at some point and uh, just, I think for just from hanging out on the internet, I'm like searching around from like looking for games that you can just kind of make your own. You know, I'm like, what if I just could play a game where, it, like, I just had a place and I can make it my own, kind of like The Sims, but not The Sims, and and uh, Animal Crossing came up and that was it. So it just kind of it ticked all the boxes at the time. So yeah, it's it's nice to take a break from certain genres of games. What's funny is now the cozy game space has taken off to the point where I almost never play like first person shooters and stuff anymore even though I used to love them. They used to be the only like the only thing I play. I need stone. I tried Splatoon for a bit and I wasn't really into it. Which is which is weird because I used to just love first person shooters, but I couldn't get into it. It's a great way to run Ryan to first session of Call of Duty. Yeah. First game was New Leaf, and I fell in love with the game immediately. I've been playing Animal Crossing since 2013. It's fun. I have some end game stuff to do. Nice. Dan Origin Story Revealed. Aran, thank you so much for the super. Appreciate you. Animal Crossing is a good game. Uh, good game to play since you're very unlikely to get mad at it. Well, I've, I've definitely found ways to get mad at it, but not... Not like, <laughs> you know, losing your 10th round of Call of Duty in a row, Matt. This is the first Animal Crossing, and I'm hooked. All I play now. <laughs> what am I crafting? I'm crafting the altar. I hope I'm crafting the altar. Uh-oh. We happen to be low on stone. How much stone do we need for this altar? So for this, we need a, this, 30. Okay. I think we can do this. My only hesitation is if I, if I break a rock right now, that will, that will make me angry. And I know I don't have any food in my stomach. But I'm going to do this anyway, just just to be extra sure. Okay, we're good. I just had to check. Yeah, no, we're good. I was earlier. I was moving a lot of trees around. I had to eat a lot of food to do that. So yeah, I can go to a Nook Island to do this, but we're already right here. Okay, I'm not going to get all the rocks from this because we put the items around, but maybe we'll get just enough to make the altar. Okay, so that's three. So 24, 25, 26, 27. Where can I stand? Maybe right here. This is the money rock, which is a shame. <laughs> Because there's really no room to get the uh, the good the good amounts of bells here. Can't use the bathroom outside. Yes, I can, and I did. Okay. We are getting a fair bit of stone. These rocks are actually distributing more uh, evenly than I thought they would. Okay, we have our 30. While we're up here, though, might as well just do one more. I gotta make sure not to pluck the roses, because that will also be upsetting. Okay. 
All right, good. That should make us the altar we're trying to craft. I didn't wash my hands. What? No, I didn't. I didn't have anything in my stomach, so all I had to do, since there was nothing in the bowl, was just put them in the bowl instead of, you know, put a sink outside. There's not a lot of room in the front of my yard right now, so that was just—it was just easier to use the bowl, right? Okay. Um, craft altar. All right, and golden altar. Forgot that the grass was brown since I time traveled back to summer. <laughs> you touch a toilet, you wash your hands 100%. Well, the, the toilet washes itself. So in this case, I just benefited from that, you know? You, you put your hands in, it, it saves water. Like, why should I waste water when the toilet's about to do its very own wash cycle? You want me to just, you know, use a whole bunch of extra water for some reason? Like, why? Okay, let's see how the altar looks right here. <laughs> Where's the plumbing? Um, that's Joey's problem. Okay, we gotta get rid of the base, I think. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Maybe we shove that right there. And then we just put a fossil on it. And that would look pretty good from down here, I think. Uh, or from down there, I mean. Should we just put some golden bars where I'm standing? Just a little something. Yeah. Like that. Now I gotta put something on the altar. Not gonna do the paint underneath. Oh right, yeah, we usually did um uh, it this is it's on an odd number of tiles. Do we wanna do the brick though? Oh gosh, yeah, probably do, right? I think we do. Let's do the bricks. Okay. Um, trying to make sure that I use ones that kind of make sense out here. Okay, that's good. All right. I think those will do there. that still. I, I need that right here. You meant paving? I got you. I figured. Um, I think for the bottoms of these, we'll just do this. No one's going to see them anyway. And this. And I guess what we can do instead of what I've done here is actually like connect up. Oh, oops. Oh, no, this would be what we want. Uh, we can connect these two. If I put that there, and I actually swap it to this style of brick right here, we can connect them pretty nicely. Hmm. Right, do one more. that 
in. We're gonna, I'm gonna take this one and curve it out. Go around this rock with it. Look at us go. This is looking fantastic. I guess we gotta take a present break here. Here we go. Boom. Give me something good. Give me a TV. Give me a flat screen. Tree's bounty little tree. I already know that. Fine. It's not a flat screen, and I already know it, but whatever. Okay. I think something like that. Uh, doesn't really work, does it? Okay, yeah, let's do that. And then we can use these here and here. All right. Yeah, that's pretty cool. I think what I'll do is something like that. We'll grab this. We'll put it at the bottom. And then we'll come back up with this and this. All right, so the area has been paved. That's looking pretty good. Mitsu was at my campsite a few weeks ago. It reminded me of that one Dream Island stream. We went crazy due to her presence. <laughs> Mitzi's very underrated, so I assume you invited her to your island. When you have your other character order you a flat screen? Because I used up all of his ordering um, windows today for this stream. <laughs> I did a lot of work before the stream. Just in terms of ordering things. Okay, here's our altar. And we had it pushed up to here. We also had gold bars behind us. Sort of. All right, and then we're gonna put something on the altar. I think what we're gonna do is find like a good fossil to go on top of that. We'll head this way. Let me also make us a sign. <laughs> Wobbly zipper toy. I wanna put uh, a a fossil. I think we can find something kind of cool. We're going right up to the museum, so I, I want it to be museum related. A villager photo on the altar. <laughs> I actually have an altar that isn't doing anything right now, so we might do that. That's a good idea. I'm going to grab a few different types of wood. I need customization kits. Did I put those away already? Yes. And fossils. What kind of fossils do I currently have available? I have a lot of unidentifieds, but we have the amber, which is great, but I actually just want to use that by itself. And then I think maybe the ammonite would be good on the altar. I think that would look really cool. Villager photo wise, the only one that's currently in gold is Raymond. But I kind of think Brewster is the better choice for that altar. That's not that's not what I wanted. I, well, no, I did want this, but not right now. But uh, let's make our sign.
Or should we do a crate? Hmm. Let's do two crate. No. Oh, I forgot crates are regular wood. I don't have any wood. Uh, hold on. Let me think. What's a sign cost? Apparently, I can't afford it. Oh, here it is. Six wood as well, so I can choose to do a crate or a sign. Um, I think a sign. I'm so pitifully low on supplies. I hear another balloon, but I'm just choosing to ignore it right now. Oh, it's like right in front of me. Um, okay, we're going to do that. We're doing the soon sign that we talked about. I'm just trying to get it ready. Oh, I'm not done. Nobody has any regular wood, to be fair. It's just always chronically gone. I I just hate it. It's I hate how hard it is to achieve an abundance of that type of lumber. Choosing words carefully. <laughs> Brewster's photo is gold. All right, that's what I want to see. You're back home, not in the casino anymore. Copper, how are you? Welcome back. So this was the, the altar I was referring to. <laughs> it's so good. Oh, man. Oh, Brewster. You can change the photo frame. Yep. And you can hang them on the wall or place them on on stuff. You get that option. Something needs to be behind this, and I don't know what. The altar by itself looks a little awkward, and we have a lot of space right here. So I, I got to figure out what to do about that. I keep trying to put this vase in different places. What, what if we try it here? Okay, that actually looks like a, a, a thing now. This looks like a, a whole gold-like thing. Okay, we're doing that. That's good. We have altars everywhere. We always have to, like, I got two here that I got to find stuff to place on top of them. All right. I got to head back over there now. We'll go this way. Oh, wait a minute. Nope, there's one more thing I wanted to grab. I cannot believe this is finally getting done, guys. We are so close. We are so, 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 so close. <sighs> um, although I did just remember one thing I'm not going to be able to get in time. I could figure out something else, but I'm a little disappointed. Uh, I'm just double checking. Um, where is it? It's tables. So I I have two of these chairs, these elegant chairs. What I need is. I can show, I have multiples of these. I need this table, but the small version of it. And I'm fresh out. Which stinks. Because I really wanted to put a table set in front of Egbert's house. I might pester somebody to send me one. Yeah, we're going to do the farmer's market. Why are you on a time limit? So I'll explain the time limit. Um, basically, I told myself... I'm going to finish this island because I've been working on it for over a year, right? And so it's about time it gets done. So I told myself we're gonna we're gonna do this project. We're gonna finish this island before the snow settles on the ground, which happens to be the 11th, which is in two days. So tomorrow I'm gonna upload the island. Now 
on the 10th, again, tomorrow, there's a big snowstorm, but the snow is not yet on the ground permanently. So that's when I'm going to upload the island for everybody. And it's going to be pretty cool because I, I we're unfortunately we're in December now. So all the Animal Crossing NPCs put up <laughs> Christmas decorations or toy day decorations, which is very annoying. And so, fine. I think the snow will help tie everything together. The grass is nice and brown still, but the snow won't be on the ground. And it'll be snowing, and it's kind of the holiday season. It kind of works. It all works, and it's a pretty gold core thing to do. It's the only day of the year that you can guarantee yourself the ability to upload your island. Um, while it's, there's heavy snow, but it's not settled on the ground yet. So I've decided that's a pretty gold core thing to keep in mind. And uh, I'm going to take advantage. Mm, I don't like this. I thought I would like that more. I actually like that. I was going to use the amber separately, but heck, I kind of like it that way. You really thought this out. Well, I've had to I've had to tell myself it's okay. It's okay that I didn't upload it in fall. And that's how I've decided to uh justify my decisions. Okay. Toilet. Oh, how about, yes, another leaf pile. That's too far off frame. Let's try again, leaf pile. These things are so temperamental. There we go. Oh, there's already one right here. Eh, let's not do that. Um, can it fit back here? Probably. There we go. Yeah, that's much better. Okay. Something else, then, right here. Some, we need something right in this spot. Is it gold bars again? Is it a dung beetle? It's so tiny. Um, candle. Maybe it's just that. <laughs> just that little guy. Yeah, okay. I think that's it. I think the cliffs are good. We can move on to the next thing. Let's do it. Oh, wait. Uh, yes. Nope. Nope. That's what we're going to do. We're going to move on. We are going to move on, and I have the next thing I want to show you. Oh, I keep forgetting. I want to get, if I have one, a wedding day flower stand to put it right here, because I just, I always thought this corner needed a little something, and that would probably be the perfect item. What do you have left to finish? We have to finish this right up here. Egbert's Farmer's Market. That's what we got to finish. So we're about to work on that. But let me see if I have a wedding flower stand. I probably do. I did give myself a bunch of them. Mm. Yes, I got two more. Perfect. Okay. All right, one second. I need to beg somebody to send me one of these tables. Cuz if I don't if I don't get this table, I'm going to be all sorts of sad. One second. Okay. I'll see if see if they come through for me. All right. Oh, you know what? I always thought something should go right here. Just this see this weird strip right here. I just always felt it needed something. I don't know what though. We might just leave it. Oops. Okay. 
Yeah, there we go. Right? I have a table. If you can if you can't get someone, we're not switch friends, but I've visited to drop things off here. Alright, cool. I'll let you know. They may come through for me. Um, do we like this? It looks a little small for this area. What if we put it here? Mm. Crud. I thought I liked this, but it's not... I don't know. Maybe something else should go here. It's just something something about this corner has always bugged me. <laughs> Maybe is it a leaf pile that I need here? It looks like they're going to hook me up. That's cool. All right. Maybe we do that. The mushroom stool with the heart bouquet? Eh. I think the I think the leaves are good. Honestly, the leaves could go here instead, too. I don't know. <laughs> um, uh, let me try them over here, too. I, I just want to see. See, I kind of like that as well. Uh, what do I do? Island decorating is so difficult. Let me get the other wedding day flower stand. I kind of wonder if, if we just use them symmetrically at the museum entrance, if at least that would look kind of cool. A Zen bench? I do have the Zen bench. I kind of want... I wish there were more gold core benches. Because this is, like, fine, but it's also, like, eh, I don't know. Not not really for what I'm doing. Lex, how's it going? I could put something on top of this Turkey Day, turkey day garden stand. Anyway, where's the flower stand? That's what I'm here for. I just saw that I had two more of these flower stands, by the way, but they're just not in gold yet. Okay, so what if these went here and here? Nope. Here. Does it kind of change the vibe in this area? Like, do we like that? Push them out of the way a little bit. I kind of like that, actually. <laughs> why Why are there two Lex the Bombs? That's kind of confusing. They have different profile pictures. <laughs> um, okay, so yeah, we could do that. You guys better hope that uh, YouTube doesn't force you to use handles in live stream chats. You won't be able to play silly games like that anymore. Mischief Managed, how's it going? Oh, there's one more thing in the campsite we got to look at. Um, also, we should probably change this. Does it not bother anyone else that um, this is gold bricks when we, we have this amazing Mahalo design now? I, I think we should customize this, fix it up. This lantern has been yellow the entire time that I've been doing this island. And I've always meant to take it to Harv's and turn it gold. And I'm going to do that right now because if I don't, I will forget. And then I'll upload the island with the yellow lantern when there's a gold option. It's just kind of embarrassing that for all this time, I haven't fixed that. Let's go.
It is gold? No. No, it's not. Trust me. Just you wait. You're going to be like, oh. Unless I was just... Maybe I did it already. I'm looking at it wrong. But I don't think I am. We've all been talking about that lantern. Yellow is fool's gold. Well, I am a fool. That is true. There's a gold option for the lantern? There is. And the thing about it is I don't know if it's always been that way or if it's, uh, what do you call it? I don't know if the lantern's always been like that or if it's a 2.0 customization. There's even another one somewhere else on my island that I did manage to turn gold. It's just this one I keep forgetting about. lantern. So this is the yellow one. This is the gold one. Boom. It was added in the update. One of those Harv exclusives. Wait, is there Harv exclusives? Is that a thing? What constitutes a Harv exclusive? There's always It's always been there? Well, now we have one. I kind of think this one. You need more bells? Oh my gosh. Oh, it was fool's school. <laughs> There's options you can only get from Cyrus. When you get them, can you still order them from the catalog once he's made you one? I didn't know that. Oops, five, three, four, four, eight. Alexi, how's it going? Greetings from Australia. How's it going? How's it going? I think so, yes. I had no idea, really. Damaged slash rusty variations are Harv exclusive. You can't buy them at Nooks. You can order them from the catalog. Okay. Huh. I had no idea. That's so cool. Uh, okay. We are doing this. Perfect withdrawal. I Yeah, I always do that. I have to keep it a round number. It has to either be... Um, it has to either end in 50,000 or 100,000. <laughs> it's, it's just a thing with me. Golden dung beetle. I just want to make sure there's nothing else in here that I'm like, oh wait, I can customize this too. The handy water cooler is already yellow. We're already good with it. Yeah, I think we're good. You have 60 million bells? I know. I've ugh, I used to have way over 20 million. My other character has a hundred million plus. And uh if I run out of money on this guy, I can always, you know, use that one. What am I doing again? Oh, 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 oh. So I've always had the water cooler on the counter. And I thought something else should go next to it. But I don't know what. You know what we need are like little like solo cups. <laughs> that would be very helpful. There's also these teacups, which would actually look probably pretty cool. Let's do one of these. With all this gold, card, gold, gold core talk, we'll actually finish it. I have to. I've set a goal for myself to upload the island tomorrow. So no matter what, it has to be done. That's why this stream is just going to keep going. I'm just not stopping it until it's done. Um, This one, even though there's no, no gold variation, I guess there's gold liquid in here. Yeah, this, it's this one. All right, let's go. I set a goal. Duh. Yes. Solo cups and a keg. Right. That's what I really need for this campsite. You're broke on your other island? No, my other island is 
I've hoarded all the wealth on that one. It's everyone else's broke. That's quite a gold. Uh, yes. You're legally obligated to finish this island. <laughs> yep. And it doesn't matter how much my throat hurts. I'm doing it. It's happening. It's basically there. It's basically where we want it. It's pretty much done. Oops. Ironic that this island has the poor relation. Sounds like you need a froggy hydration check. Uh, where is my stall? Here it is. Alright, we've updated the stall. We're going to put the uh, thing on back on it. This, this thing. And the teacup. Boop. You know what that is, right? Anyone guess what's in the teacup? It's steamy and it's gold. It's not just any lemonade. This is hot lemonade. Mm-hmm. We've come full circle. Hot lemonade has returned. And there is a hot lemonade stand on my gold core island. Hot lemonade, heated up, specifically by the sun. Um, you need to let it sit out so it gets nice and hot. Uh, sometimes little bugs and stuff land in there, but uh, you know, it's all part of it. That's it's like it's more of a delicacy. You uh, you know, you pay good money for for a nice cup of authentic hot lemonade. Awesome for a sore throat, incidentally. I'll just pretend it's ginger turmeric tea. <laughs> Midas? Uh, here. So I'm coming back over here because we also have our uh, our sign we decided we wanted to put down here. I don't know exactly where this is going to fit, but we're going to try it. Soon. Oh, maybe I can it out no okay I want red's boat to still like be you know something I can walk on where could the sign go I wanted it to be something you could see but not not like right up in your face I legit drink hot lemonade in the microwave when I have a sore throat. Well, you should try leaving it outside and getting some, like, mosquitoes and stuff in there. Do I have any golden stag models? Uh, a few, yeah. Someone gave me a few, so I did, I did kind of put those around. Where are we going to put the soon sign? Okay, I have, a backup, I have a backup spot for the soon sign. over here. This is another one of our uh, Easter eggs. How do I get back up here now? Now that I've put this altar and stuff blocking my way, like the island is less traversable than it's ever been. <laughs> I, I just can't get up there. Hot lemonade supremacy. Oh, no, there's the back of this cliff, too. We should probably just leave this, though, right? I was really considering doing something up here. Do I have a tree? I have two trees. I wanted to see if I could fit a tree back here. If not, I think I'll just leave it. It would probably have to go right here if we could. Dang it! See, yeah, if I could put a tree right here... It's such a big chunk of, of cliff that's missing put some paths down. Uh, I really just wanted a tree. 
but I'd have to scale the I'd have to scale this cliff up here back a little bit to fit the tree. Maybe I should do it. Maybe I should do it. Oops. That was the wrong button. Yeah, lemon trees. Yeah, we had a lot of different types of trees in, in New Leaf. You could put a tree standy. Eh, that's, that's not very gold core. Oh, I think we got our table. Thank you, kind table giver. Perfect Fruit was a great way to make some extra money, um, especially when you were starting out. Because I, I have a new fresh save I've been playing on for New Leaf, and I, I got a Perfect Fruit like on day one, and it was game-changing. It was awesome. Oh, I can't push it that far back, because then I can't fix the... Okay. Just trying to fix my custom designs, since we're going to be... Uh, tearing out some cliff here. Oops. Okay. Let me just put down that path. And I guess I'll just do the same one. Oh, I can't. Um... Okay, wait. Don't worry. We will figure this out. We'll put that there. And I think what we'll do is we'll put this here. Okay, that's looking pretty good. Sweet. Now we can fit our tree. Yes. Okay, perfect. Go us. All right, climb back up here. Push our rock back where we want it. Yep, this still looks pretty much the same. And now we have an extra money tree planted down. We have one more money tree we can place if need be. I've been meaning to do that with that back cliff area forever. <laughs> it's just so, such like an awkward chunk of cliff. All right, now the campsite's done, maybe. Cool. Uh, our soon sign. We just, we completely forgot. That's the mission we were originally on. <sighs> I'm just going to go down the long way. Because by the time I figure out a good way down to the area I'm trying to get to, I could have just gone the long way. I took the extra long way. Ooh, well. I was hoping Catman would do minigames. That would have been nice. Um, I got to a point with Catman where I just stopped taking his boat tours because I kind of got everything out of them I needed. And that's a shame because if we had gotten minigames, we would have had many more reasons to go see Catman. Okay, so for the soon sign, I thought this would be a good spot for it. I wanted something over here anyway, and we have a little bit of cliff. So you see how see how I'm just kind of like peeking out there? I just like that. It's like, what soon? It's so concerning. Pull it back a little bit. Yeah. If you if you're running, you could almost miss it. Sue. <laughs> So there we go. All 
All right, our soon sign is placed. I love the random threatening signs. Did you guys see the yacht earlier? Were you guys here for the yacht? Oh, we got a cooking recipe. What's this? Seafood salad. Hmm. Hold on. I'm getting another another bit of inspiration here. You can't well No, you can't place stuff on holes in the ground. Never mind. I'm gonna leave that build as it is. Oh, the soon sign brings much joy. Very much joy. Thank you for making it. Uh, I'm just looking up here because I'm realizing that I never placed anything on top of those uh, towers. So we got to do that as well. I'm just gonna do. I'm gonna go with gold helmets because they look amazing. All right, we're left with Egbert's Farmers Market. It's time. Uh, we need to rearrange our inventory a little bit. Just a little. And by that I mean uh, we need to put things away. Oops. This is not how you put things away. What is wrong? What is going on with me right now? Put something away. Okay. Okay. Good, 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 good. Uh, actually, keep keep the crafting materials in my inventory because I'm probably going to want them. Yep, that looks good. And then we need some other crafting materials. I think most of this is going to have to be crafting materials because we're, we're just low, low, low on stuff. On items themselves. Uh, hmm. Yeah, I want some weeds, man. Here we go. I suppose we can start there. How much is left to complete on the island? I'll try to stay up with you guys at my fork tomorrow. Uh, we have to do... Oh, and in front of Joey's house. You're right. Yeah, we have to do Egbert's Farmer's Market and in front of Joey's house. And I'm going to take this stone axe. And I'm going to chop up my coconut trees so the coconuts are not on them. And I also get some extra wood because I need it. Let me see if I can find a good counter or something. Hmm. Oh, we still got to put this toilet in the arena. Oh my gosh, I'm going to forget something, you guys. I just know it. I'm going to have to do a very thorough check tomorrow before I upload this Dream Island. I'm going to forget something so important. Maybe the counter table? I don't know which one to use. It looks like the island won't be deleted. Yay. Well, the night is young. Just made it. How late am I? Uh, well, we started streaming three and a half hours ago, so not super late. What if we used the wedding head table? What do you think? Would that That's not like a good work table, though. Let me grab a couple of turkey day stands and we'll play around. I think I think I know what I want to do by Joey's house. Okay. Is this everything? Did you want to amiibo someone in the campsite? Yes. Yes, I do. I'll have to do that tomorrow when I do the upload, but yeah. That's another thing I could very easily forget. How are we? Doing good, Interlude. How are you? Let me grab... You know what I'm going to do? Sticky Notes app. I'm going to make a sticky note real quick. Okay. Apparently. 
apparently the sticky notes app backs up. It just had me log in and it has all my old sticky notes. Great. Um, all right. So it's a checklist of things I need to do before I upload. So amiibo in a campsite villager. Put toilet in arena. <laughs> okay. Excuse, excuse me. I'm just going to put the toilet in the arena now. Oh, um, fill out notice board. I got to do that too. The notice board is going to be really important. Okay. So for those who don't know, the toilet is because it's like our last little insurance policy to make sure that if people are going to play in the arena, they're going to do so with an empty stomach. So it, it just makes absolutely sure that they can't enter the arena with food in their guts. And also it's gold. Okay, good. So yeah, you need an empty stomach if you're going to have the most fair shot at completing this. Proud of you finishing your island, dude? Me too. Thank you. I'm, I'm pretty proud of me too. I'm proud of all of us. You guys give a lot of awesome suggestions. We are going to thrash these trees because we don't want them to have coconuts when we upload the island. And um, I need a bunch of wood. This is the yacht I was talking about, by the way. That's an arena I will not be entering. <laughs> not without pooping first. I'm probably going to need another one of these axes. But we'll just... We'll get as far as we can. Yep. <laughs> Dang it. I don't know why, but I was expecting... A large battlefield with a single toilet in the middle. <laughs> That's the... Yeah, next time. You are just shaking the trees? Because I'm completely out of, like, regular wood, and I have stuff I want to craft, so it's just... Uh, it makes sense to just go ahead and do it this way. All right. What do we got? Oh, okay. Flimsy axe. We have the flimsiest of axes. I'll, I'll buy two. You know what? That's fine. You need to break a hundred axes to get the gold axe recipe, so I might as well continue trying to break this. A gold bidet? Do they have that? Because I haven't seen that item. There's also... I need to put something right here. It just, this, this spot needs something, anything. Um, put another item by Nooks for flyover. Okay, great. The gold altar would be a little too big. I need something in between gold altar and golden dung beetle. Where are we going? Okay. Now we can continue chopping trees.
This is exactly what I need. I got supplies. I got the coconuts gone. Another golden bunny? Yeah, something like that would probably be good. Although, I don't... Well, no, I did order some more bunnies. Okay, great. Um, now we pick it all up. <laughs> Remember you doing a live stream on this island a long time ago when you started it out and you read my comment and I freaked out. <laughs> yeah, I, I know. Sometimes people forget that when I say I can't read, I'm just joking. It still shocks me too, actually. Did I get everything? I think I got everything here. Coco might be considering leaving, and I'm not going to let that happen. Are you trying to finish by 5 a.m.? Uh, no, I'm I'm going to try and finish by whenever. Um, I was hoping to be done by now, but it's okay. I'm going to keep going, and uh, then tomorrow I'm going to do the final like check where I just run across the island and make sure everything's good. And my plan is to upload it around 5 p.m. Eastern because I would like that, that uh, 5 p.m. music to be on the island as well. So I think that'll be cool. But I might upload it sooner, just in case, uh, I don't know, if, I start, if I'm playing at that time and it, it's looking kind of dark, I don't want it to be too dark on the island when I upload it. And since it's going to be snowing, um, <laughs> it could be. It could be kind of dark, so we'll see. Okay, so these trees are vacant. There's nothing laying underneath them other than shells. We should be good. All right, let's keep going. We're getting lots of supplies, which is great. Perfect. 4.59 a.m. You're frantically placing items. <laughs> Just trying to look. Make sure I didn't miss anything on the ground here. Love the little announcer. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Squeakoid. That, uh, yeah, we wanted to have someone in there taking care of the broadcast. Okay. Still got to put something on these altars over here, too. I, I just don't know what. It has to make sense. Um, we should probably do the other side while we're just shaking out trees here. Get all the trees done in one go. Knowing me, I'll forget. Uh, here, let's... I don't know which flimsy axe I was using, but let's use this one. Any additional jars of farts on altars? Uh, I don't know. I want... I want something that makes sense for what will be the island entrance for those dreaming of the island. I thought about maybe, um, like, I don't know, tools, like a golden, like a golden wand. That could be fun. Like if you, if you find it, you can walk around with it. 
King Tut head. Because one thing I didn't leave any room for at all was the... Um, not that. Uh, was the... Sorry, I can't think right now. Oh, this tree, you can't... Look at that. I've made a tree you can't shake coconuts off of. I've trapped it so well that you actually physically cannot remove the coconuts from that tree. Oh my gosh. Okay, well that's a little annoying because i got to upload this dream island and it's not going to look like the rest of the trees. So <laughs> I guess I better get to work figuring that out, but I didn't know you could do that. So what I have to do is move this out of the way. Okay, and then I, I lose one coconut. All right. And see, this is why I didn't want to move the wheat field, because it wasn't going to go right, right where I wanted it. Okay, there we go. November lights or star fragments? What are November lights? Star fragments could be cool. I can't get that coconut. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh no. Come on. Um. Oh no. I don't want to move all this stuff. Um. Okay, let's do it. I guess it was there. All right. <laughs> Hopefully it was there. Nova lights. Okay. Um, Nova lights. I don't know if they're going to fit the vibe over there. Could do them, but I don't know. Yeah, I want to upload it at the golden hour, which is 5 o'clock, I believe. But uh, it's going to be snowing, so I just don't know how golden that hour is going to be. But the music at 5 o'clock is probably my favorite. Oh, shoot. Okay. Oh, I missed one. Star fragments are smaller. I am kind of thinking I should just put like a wand and um, I don't know, something else. Maybe what, what it would be is two wrapped presents and I'll wrap up a wand and I'll wrap up a crown or, or something else. And uh, people can, you know, have some souvenirs as they walk around the island. Do you have dropped gold ornaments anywhere? Too gimmicky? Um, when you say ornaments, what, uh, what are you referring to? Because I have a lot of dropped gold everything everywhere. Do we get everything? Is every single coconut off all the trees? And the trees have nothing behind them? We're good. I think we're good. I did get the golden wand yesterday, yes. We we got that just in time. <laughs> the ones from the cedar trees. Are are you talking about like the holiday ornaments that we're gonna have coming soon in December? Like late December? Because I have a few of those, but I don't know. I don't know if I want those around. It's not a terrible idea. I just don't think I... Uh, I don't think I need them at this point. I think we're good. <laughs> oh my gosh. Alright. Thank you for that. Thank you for, the, thank you for the gold table. I like the gold letterhead. That was great. Oh, I'm trying to delete it. There we go.
Okay, this is not gold. I was told this was going to be covered in gold, but I guess I'll do it myself. <sighs> Should I just go do that now? Oops. They lied! <laughs> At least the letter was. Yeah, that's true. The letter was gold. I, You know what I just realized? I don't have a mini gold Dharma like I wanted to do. I need to, I need to uh, load up my other character and see if I can send myself one. I think I have one more letter from the airport that I can send this character from that, from my other character. Uh, Harbs. A beige core island? <laughs> yep, that one table is going to have to uh, force me to change my entire island overnight. Okay. I'm turning on my other switch right now. I'm getting that ready. We gotta fix this table. Which is here. So there's gold. Now here's the problem. I don't remember what I did for the cloth underneath. I honestly think I left them white. Does anyone know? Because <laughs> otherwise... Well, you know what? Actually, I think I can customize this part at home. I think the top cloth I can't change unless I come here. All right. I think we'll be good. The large tables have the white cloths? I don't remember what the ones by my place had. Oh well. Um, all right. One second. I'm looking up a recipe right now. My other switch. It won't take me but a sec. Okay. I do have these. The mini golden dharma and the golden dharma I have. So, I want to craft one of those for myself and, and mail it. So, I know you can't see what I'm doing right now, but it should only take a second. What we talked about was Egbert having, like, a golden egg that he was going to sell. And I've always liked that idea, but I couldn't do it because I don't have the recipe. But this character does. Um, and he also happens to have a couple of mini dharmas. So I'm just going to craft one real quick. Okay. Do you want to listen? I know you're not watching it right now, but you can listen to me craft it. Here, it's happening. Um. There, see? I told you. I'm totally crafting something. Noble, how's it going? You're joining us at a good time. I'm, I'm doing something off camera. And I apologize for the, the thrilling content here. Let's, let's start heading back to the airport here. I thought it was on a loading screen. Here we go. Love to cook some Easter eggs. Oh, that sounds good. All right. Let me mail this to myself here. Go home. Yep. Perfect. All right. Uh, mini Golden Dharma.
Perfect. We did it. So I now have a golden egg. That's what it's going to look like. Sweet. Turn that one off. Come up here. And we will grab our mini golden dharma. Oops. Uh, open. Sweet. Oh my gosh, it looks just like a golden egg. That is fantastic. <laughs> Yay. Okay. A uh, crafting table. We're probably going to want that up there. So let's borrow this one. Literally perfect. It is. All right. And it looks like the tablecloths underneath are, in fact, white. That's exactly what we wanted to see. So we will put this table all the way up against the wall as far as we can. It looks like our chair covers are a bit different than I was anticipating. We made those also white, but I should be able to customize those here. So let me, I'm gonna put my uh, crafting station by the throne. Jared, how's it going? And we need these two chairs. Perfect. Have I been putting things on the tables? No. The tables are vacant. I'm good with that. Let's see. Customize. Okay, I just don't have customization kits, but they are customizable. And those are in here. I thought I had everything I needed for this build, but apparently I did not. Do you guys ever mix up flour with customization kits? Because <laughs> that always happens to me. Elegant chair, elegant chair, yep. White and stripe, I think, is what we're doing. Yep. Perfect. Seven customization kits a piece. That's so expensive. Okay, place that uh, there. Place this one right here. Perfect. Uh, we will redo the the stall. We're gonna put the other Mahalo crest on it, or not? Oh, it has a red top. Uh. Yeah, we'll do that. Right? Or should we... I kind of like the dark wood. Let's go with what we had originally. Let's do that. Which we wouldn't literally need to change anything, but that's fine. Kato! How are you? Welcome back. Everyone's got to go check out Kato. Um... See what you're streaming lately. What are you streaming lately? Still playing uh, Dreamlight Valley? I think you were playing Animal Crossing earlier. I wasn't able to watch. What? Uh, what are we doing? I was gonna. I have a stall. Oh, 
I'm looking for more items now for this build. We need some farmer's markety things, and I'm very low on items, so we're going to have to make some stuff work. We might want to use the potted starter plants. Um, I played Animal Crossing earlier the whole winter island I have to finish before the 25th of December. <laughs> or what? Do you delete it? Are the stakes really high? Could do shopping baskets, but meh. I think a lot of the stuff we use today is going to be crafted. We could do some some pottery, maybe. Hmm. Maybe a sturdy paper bag. I like the idea of maybe newspapers. The old-fashioned wash tub could be just a cool item to put in the background somewhere. What I was hoping for was one of those little signs that you can customize. The ones that say like 50% off and all that stuff, but I don't have one. I just want to finish it because last year I didn't and it turned out and or it turned into a Christmas February island. <laughs> so you've been giving me all this crap for not finishing my gold core island. And meanwhile, you've been sitting on this secret. You had an island that you didn't finish in time, and you had to wait a whole year to go back and try and finish it on time. We are just the same, and you time travel too. We are just the same. And you have been just giving me relentless crap for not finishing this island. It's so unfair. I've been, I've been taking it like a champ because I'm like, you know, yeah, you're right. You're right. I suck. I suck at islands. I get it. But now I find out that you also suck at islands and you were just like projecting this whole time. I am thoroughly distracted. I'm such a bully. You are. You're bullying me like crazy over this. Customize cardboard boxes into various produce boxes. Yes. Love that idea. I actually have various produce boxes here. We got apples, we got peaches, and we got orange. Yep, we got pockets full. That's what we got. We got nothing but pockets full. You just tell me my islands suck. Suck at islands. You make good islands. You just suck at getting them out on time. This is some, this is the difference. That's all. Well, let me at least put down our golden egg. <laughs> Such a good item. I need I need my friend to send me that 50% off style desk sign. Because if they do, I can put it here and I can customize it the way I want. And it'll look really, really good. So hear me now. If you, if you want to send that sign, that'd be really cool. Didn't you finish this yesterday? I finished my last like big build, and now we're doing the finishing touches, the little bits of polish that the island needs before I can call it complete. And then tomorrow, I have to upload it. I think what we need for this is some hay bales. I'm trying to decide how I want the stalls arranged as well. Can we fit back here if I do this? No, okay. I don't like that. Um, let's do that. And should I do another stall kind of in front of it a little bit so you can kind of like wind through the market? That might be fun. Are you going to take a big break after this? Well, I'll tell you one thing. I'm probably going to take a break from streaming and not stream tomorrow, but <laughs> I haven't even decided that yet. Maybe I will. I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'm just hurting for punishment. I want to play Dreamlight Valley. So excited for the dream address. Thank you. I am too. Okay, let's get this stall customized here. Oh, 
Oh, yeah. Uh, what did we say? Yeah, we did. We wanted to do the dark brown and then that. Perfect. You need a winter break like me? So glad I don't have to go back to college till January 17th. I seriously need a break. Yeah, it's it's always nice to just be able to take some time off. It's also, since we're getting to the holidays, I'm also, like, taking extra time off work as well. Just here and there. Just just to give myself, a, you know, that break I need. I think this looks pretty nice. Uh, having the stalls like this is pretty cool. We could also, we could push this one here and, and push this one here just to get it right off the, you know, just get it off the house a little bit. Is this the final build? I think so. Yeah, this is it. Um, we got a few things we need to do to make this, uh, work. I gotta put something here, like, and I gotta put something right here would be nice. Another gold rose would be great, but I am officially out. Could do a lily. Just for fun. Wish I got time off for the holidays. Wish we crazy hours. Ah, oh, sorry about that. Ugh, been there. No fun. Golden helmets are the towers. We got to do that too. I'm just going to put away all these extra things I have. Jeez. We got to do Joey's stuff as well. Keep forgetting every Sonica gifts. For once, I actually got all of my... I think all of my uh, shopping done for the holidays early. And so because of that, in that spirit, I've been trying to help people do their holiday shopping as well. And so there's all kinds of affiliate links down below for a whole bunch of gift ideas. One of them being Animal Crossing, which I checked today. It's still on sale, which is awesome. Um, these are still on sale. And in fact, they're cheaper. So if you're looking to get your friend uh, or family member a micro SD card for their Switch or their Steam Deck or whatever it might be, these are these are fantastic and then your squishmallow mystery boxes of course these are a favorite and uh these are just great to send as gifts for for fellow collectors so tom nook what are you doing why did you just send me into ad mode get your stupid sad eyes out of my face i'm so sorry about that guys i think he just he just pops up and he just puts the spell on me he's just so ugh. He's such a scumbag. He ruined this live stream just now, and I apologize. Goodness gracious. What what a nightmare. Um, Okay, I don't even remember what you were doing that was so distracting. He's such an attention seeker. I know. Just conning me into talking about products that you should buy. Spend your money, like, or save it. I don't know. Should we make this? It's not very gold core. I gotta remember, I am doing a gold core farmer's market. Is there anything I can do that's like... What if what if they f sold free-range grass-fed toilets? I don't know. Or <laughs> chocolate gold bars? What else we got? Oh, okay, so we wanted to make these for Joey. Let me just craft a few of these right now before I forget. Remember, you can click any of Tom Nook's links and just buy toilet paper, and that supports Dan. That's true. If you use those links, and then you stray away from the pages that they bring you to, and then you buy something else that still supports the channel, which is pretty cool. Affiliate links are fun. Um, and those particular links down there are actually set up so that if you are in another country, it's going to bring you to the Amazon page for your country, or it's going to do its very best job to do that. So that is kind of nice. But Tom Nook didn't do that. I had to do that because he's a lazy sack of crap. We could do this. I don't know. What about... So there's a basket of fruit. Oh, here we go. I was going to say, what about the veggie basket? I don't have this stuff. <laughs> Dang it. I don't think I have enough veggies to make the veggie basket, but that would be really nice for the farmer's market. Let me just look. Hmm. 
Let me just see. What if I do? I have tomatoes, wheat, potatoes, carrots, sugar cane. I'm missing. I'm like, ooh, do I have everything? I'm missing sugar cane. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's not fine, but I'll make I'll make do. It could be fruit. I have all the fruit. I could just make a fruit basket instead. Check with leaf, but leaf doesn't just sell raw sugar cane. I can't I can't like grow sugar cane right now. <sighs> Apples, cherries, orange, peach. Yeah, we have everything we need for a fruit basket. Next best thing. Can other damn make it and bring it over after the stream? He might be able to, but eh. Sounds like work. He he's so busy, he hasn't even um you know <laughs> fixed up his uh He's still dressed for Halloween. You know what I mean? Probably shouldn't bother him. Um. If I placed it from this side, would it would it tilt the other way? No, that doesn't look right. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, just just leave it there. Okay, so I kind of like that. I need you to leave. Can you just go work out in your gym or something? Like, go away. Where are those newspapers? Old-fashioned wash tub. Um, paper bag. Cardboard boxes. A decoy ducks. Where? What? I grabbed them. Carver box, wash tub. Oh, here we go. Yeah. So recycled paper. We might need something else next to it. Can I put the wash tub next to it? No, the wash tub's kind of big. Um, it's a good item. And then we also talked about the 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 boxes for the fruit. Let's go grab some more of those. I don't know why I started crafting. <laughs> Dang it. Let's see. Are these all, are these the hidden items I keep missing bits from the stream? Oh, I don't, no, I, I'm just trying to find cool stuff to put on the ground. I don't think I have anything that can go on the bottled crates. We'll just, we'll leave it at that. Okay. Cardboard box. Perfect. There we go. <laughs> Guess what I got? Oh my gosh. I just got word. Here we go. This is going to be... You guys are going to be really excited about this. How do you get all these items to play your secrets? Oh, just lots of collecting. I have not a 50% off sign. Please accept if this item in its place. Wait, what? 
It's not gonna work if it's not the. Well, hold on. What is it? Pop up toaster. This is nothing to. This literally has nothing to do with what I need. I can't. I can't do my gag with a pop up toaster. Oh my god. Like, what? Scam mail. I got scammed. Look, if I put this toaster here, it doesn't flip and work. It's I'm not it's not a breakfast stand. It's supposed to be a gold egg. It's super valuable. And I wanted that sign so that I could customize it to be the little hand that's pointing at it because I thought that'd be hilarious. But now I just have a stupid toaster. You got toasted. It's eggs. It's a breakfast stand. No, I don't want a breakfast stand. I wanted, I wanted a golden egg stand. Now I gotta like make my own. What the heck am I even supposed? <sighs> I don't know what to do about this. I'm so disappointed in, in everybody. Eggs or breakfast? It's not the. That's not the point. Why is everyone so hung up on breakfast right now? I don't want a breakfast stand. Okay. You know what? We'll do it ourselves. It's fine. It's fine. I will make it myself. I'm... I give up. I just give up. I don't even know what I'm in doing in here. I don't want this. Wait a minute. No, I don't want this. <sighs> where, uh, where, where are we? We need to make... We need this. Okay. I think I can use one of these. Uh, oh, no, I can't because it's... They don't let me do a transparency on it. That's silly. All right. Well, what else can I do? I know what to do. All right. Don't worry, everybody. I know exactly what we need to do. Uh, oh, uh, we'll make this black, I guess. Is this the front? I guess this is the front. It's going to have to be the front. All right. E. Oops. G. And another G. I'm going to need more room. I think that's enough room. This G is not as hardy as the first G that I made. Okay. We'll make this work. All right. Is that, is that even? Did I do that right? Yeah. Yeah. Looks like Halloween colors. I'm working on it. We're not done. <sighs> I have my egg sign now. All right. I'm making my own egg sign because I guess you can't get good help on the internet for free. Lesson learned. 
Lesson flippin' learned. I don't know what I'm doing right now. What's going on? I need this. I wanted to see, does that look... It kind of changes the font a little bit, doesn't it? Uh, they look like broken sixes now. I actually don't like that at all. Let's sculpt the letters so they're a bit more friendly. That, uh, that probably wasn't the right one to take. We could do... No. Uh, leave that one. Is that a good G? What do we need? You know what we need? We need to do... Oops. Um, we need to do that. We need to make it very clear that this is a G. And if we take the orange, we can... This is terrible. This is going bad. Why did I get left to do this on my own? Barb, how's it going? It's, it's, it, things have been better. It looks excellent. Don't start this again. No, 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 no. We're not doing excellent. E66. <sighs> Crap. You're right. It looks, that looks more like egg, doesn't it? Maybe it should be three. Eh, it doesn't have to be three. Let's we'll do that. Okay, in any case. Eh? Egg. I take out the bottom two squares? Yeah. I think that was I think that was a good call. Do we like do we like the lettering now? I think it's good. Perfect. Okay, I'll take it. I'll take perfect. All right. Why can't it be breakfast? It's it's the principle now. That's why. Um so we're going to we're not going to change the whole palette. We're just going to change this to gold. We need to we need to goldify this flag here. So maybe Maybe somewhere in there. That's pretty gold, right? And then... Let's see. We're going to put a... You know, like a, a border on this. I don't think that one counts. I think it has to be up. Uh, so we'll, we'll come out to here. There it is. Okay, and then we'll we'll make it real fancy, just like that. Yep, 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 yep. All right, and then we'll go into here, and we will change its brightness a little bit, just to yeah. Just, just make it a little more subtle. Hold on, let me just. How's that? I think that's pretty good. All right. What's this tool do? Swap slash copy. Which part do you want to work on? This. Okay, but now what, what I want, I want to work on this. I want this over here. Copy. No, 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 no. Copy. Yes, that's all I want. Okay, now if I flip it. Yeah, it should be egg on both sides. That's what I want. Okay, perfect. Eggtastic. We did it. Uh, here we go.
Egg flag. Right? What other little symbols and stuff do we have? Do we have do we have a trademark? Here. We'll make one. Perfect. Okay. So, since I can't have the sign I want because people just want to troll me with toasters, now I made my own. So the joke's on you. My sign is awesome. Perfect. I've now <laughs> effectively labeled the uh, the mini dharma egg. It only took like 20 minutes of our very valuable time. <sighs> I hope everyone's satisfied. Better than a toaster. It is better than a toaster. Most things are. Did you know I don't even own a toaster? And my life is fine. I can make a barrel. Let's make a barrel. Alright. You do now. <laughs> I want to stay in craftable items here. Let's see. What I'm thinking we probably need is a... Oh, we, we definitely need a bunch of these. Um, like a hay bed. What if your Wi-Fi cuts out again? Gosh, I hope it doesn't. Let's make another hay bed. Why do you hate toast? I just don't really eat bread. Uh, let's see. That's not the craftables. These are the craftables. What else? What else? What else? Not to be that guy, but why does a gold island have a farmer's market? So, long story. Um, I had to invite Egbert to the island because we ran out of time. And... I needed to do, uh, you know, a gold core villager. And the only gold core villager amiibo I had left was Egbert. And because it's Egbert, I thought it'd be fun to give him the, you know, the job of running a farmer's market. There's a food scale in your storage? Oh, yeah. Thank you. Thank you, WebPixies. That's a great idea. Um... How are you rich, Rich? Uh, I, I did a lot of turnips. You can customize the sturdy paper bag? Oh my gosh. You guys. We can put whatever we want on this. Soon. <laughs> uh. Oh no. I didn't want this. Oh no, what am I doing? Why can we customize that? That's not fair. Why on earth would they let us do that? I like this fruit crate. This is kind of cool. Okay. I was going to clean up, but my pockets... Blah, 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 blah. Uh, can I put the wooden box on top of this? No, it goes back there. That's not what I want. Um, oh, we can put it out here. Yeah, yeah, let's put it out here. We can also put like a record player or something on top of it just to give our farmer's market some vibes. Here, let's see. Uh... Ugh, there we go. Fruit crate. I 
wanted these next to it, but like not like this. Maybe I, they, maybe they should just go on top. Yeah, that's fine. All right, this is looking pretty good. We gotta get that scale. I like that idea. Do you think the scale's a good color or do I need to go to Harv's? Oh, I don't wanna go to Harv's. Let's see. Um, I guess it's as close to a gold core scale that I could get. It's just kind of ugly. Is it not? Is it not kind of ugly? Maybe it'll be fine. Maybe, maybe it'll be okay. Hmm. I'm just looking around. Uh, there could be a place for the phonograph. Except my pockets are full, so don't worry about it. How do I record it like this? Um, so I'm using a capture card. It is a device that lets you plug any HDMI input into your computer and shows it to you guys. So, yeah. Um, this is actually my Nintendo Switch. And uh, if you wanted to learn more about some of the gear that I use, by the way, if anyone's interested, similar to the affiliate link GIFs, I also have at the very bottom of the description more affiliate links for the gear that I use and recommend. I don't talk about it a lot. It's way at the bottom of the description. It's a lot of scrolling. I don't want to hurt your, your scroll fingers. This toaster sure is taking up valuable space in my uh, inventory. Just let it be known that I hate my new toaster. How's that? I think that's... I actually really like that scale there. I like it a lot. Uh, let's put down the... Oh, I was going to put the crate, but I, I forgot. I already found a home for it. Dang it. Uh, no, did I say something that Taylor Swift people say? I'm sorry. I didn't, I didn't mean to. <laughs> what kind of fruit do I have? Let me put a peach. Actually, no. I'm not going to put a peach on this. I'm going to put a gold nugget on it. Part of the gold nugget scavenger hunt. Don't tell nobody. Oh. No one would suspect one up here. Boop. Hee hee hee. Okay. What am I going to put on that one? Probably a helmet, right? Oh no, oh, I've made such a mess. Okay, uh. Dang it. I gotta put something on top of that tower. We can't. We can't finish this island without something on top of that tower. Here. Let's start making some helmets. I'm going to put some garbage away, like toasters. And fruit. Mostly just toasters, though. I got to redo this little, uh, this little area back here. Or you know what? We can actually do this. We can pull this, push this back here. One, two, you know, three, pull that there. And then... I can do this. We can drop this helmet. Oh, that's not what I meant. <laughs> okay, place the helmet. Okay, let me do that. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Excellent. That was too much. I'll never live that down. No, that is, that's, uh, that person to me now is known forever as Toasty. Should I put a hay bed right over here? 
I don't know. Pe people probably shouldn't be sleeping on the edge of cliffs, but it kind of fits nicely. And maybe maybe I can invite my toaster friend to come over, and they can just that's where they sleep. Oh no! Did you fall off a cliff and into the river overnight? Oh no! Oh gosh! I hope you didn't get hurt much. Let's see, wash tub. I don't know. I want the wash tub somewhere. I want, a, I want a few things somewhere. What do we do about this, guys? Do I just add more gyroids? I probably just add more gyroids. And then we gotta do something to block it off. Why is every streamer from iPod? It's just the easiest thing to like put on your channel real quick and have it do things. Gold armor. Yeah, gold armor. It's a good way to block things off. Hmm. I have that barrel now. That's a good way to block things off, too. More gyroids. Okay. Jeez. Um, how about... I just need some random ones. Uh, we need, like, different... Just random colors. One of our oinkoids. Um, slap a squeakoid in there. Talkoid. All right. Why did I stop? What a weird place for me to stop putting gyroids, by the way. Like, right here. Strange, right? You're facing the wrong way. Okay. I think that's a good stopping point for them. Alright. There you go. Alright. We can fit one more. What would one more gyroid hurt? Perfect. Alright, we have proper cheering going on now. Any more? I don't think I don't think we should. I mean we could fit one right here. And I have one more. Okay, now no more. <laughs> no more gyroids. We need that barrel. Okay. <laughs> oh, man. Dragon Slayer, we'll see you later. Oh, my gosh. There it is. Look at the moon hovering over it. I need a picture. Can I get one in first person? Would that look... Can I get the moon? Ah, oh, no, I can't. Here, let's, let's see what we can get. Oh, it's not working. Dang it. Stupid moon. Whatever. It doesn't work without the moon floating over it like that. We can put the washboard thing underneath it. This thing. Just to put just to put a couple like items. It's almost like Egbert's like storing some stuff over here in the stadium, which makes no sense at all. Um, we need a tall thing right here. Something something's gonna block people and look kind of impressive and distract from this ugly wall back here. And it kind of feels like I need a little something right here, too. What do I got? Decoy ducks, turkey day garden stands. I think that's everything I currently just have. So I gotta, I gotta find some stuff. I'm gonna flim flam the scale and the fruit. Like that. And 
and note scale scale there it is plant partition hedges hedges could be good well I don't know they're kind of I need I don't know what else do we have We gotta have something, right? Uh, could be these storefronts. We got two golden storefronts, but they're, I don't know, they'd be kind of awkward up here. Let's see. I don't think this is gonna work at all. Uh, They're weird, right? Not, that's not that's not it we can do better actually truly don't know if we can do better <laughs> uh, it's gotta be something why the eggs it's Egbert Egbert you know is a chicken and egg in his name. What more? Did, I don't know how else to explain it. There can't be much more to s explain. Egg Bert, gold eggs. It's gold in Gold Core Island. Egg Bert. Oh, what if we put one of? Th nah. Eggs equal farmers market and a chicken with a giant gold egg not laid by any creature known to this world. Yeah. See, you get it. There's got to be something that would fit in there. A bike? Like, for some reason, a mountain bike in there? Is there anything more gold core we can do? I knew I should give myself that other bike that I had. Hmm. Well, I don't know what to do. <laughs> I think I need to go I need to go back into the crafting menu because none of this stuff none of this stuff is going to work. The only other thing I do is like these these types of like different plants and stuff. When did you first discover your love for gold? I just saw an opportunity to do something dumb. I mean, that's that's really what this is all about, right? Just hey, all these people are making themed islands. What if mine was really ridiculous? So probably about then. That looks really nice. This plant. Look at this thing. This plant is OP. What a great plant. What a great plant. The only other place it would look better is right in there. Like tucked right in. Look at that. Look at that plant. Look at that thing. Oh. Do you guys see this plant right now? That plant. Mmm. It's a good plant. I have an idea. I know what we need to do over there. We're leaving the plant. But then also... We're going to do these fences. Corrugated fence. And it's going to look good. Um, we're going to get rid of these for just a moment. And we're going to place down some of these corrugated fences because they'll they'll fit this vibe perfectly. Look at that. That's what we want. Castle gate. 
Uh, getting that back where we had it is going to be a challenge. Is that it? Ugh, okay. Topiary? Done. Okay, now it kind of looks a little more, just a tiny bit more finished. It's not perfect, but it's it's good. We got the plant. You got the soon thing poking out there. You got the barrel. Um, the fence protecting you from yourself. I guess the only thing I would do differently is maybe more of the fence, but then I couldn't fit my cool plant over there. You know. So yeah. All right. This is good. This is good. It's great, actually. Um, I think for farmers market, we're pretty we're pretty much done over here in the farmers market, I think. What do you guys think? I don't know if there's anything else I can add to this farmer's market that would make it uh, more farmers or market. Except something right here. Maybe a light. Is island 100%. Mm, no. There's a, one more thing. Okay, now you want to know what we think? What? Last time I asked for help... Someone sent me a toaster and ruined my build. So what do you want? Blame them. I don't know what to say. Do you guys think this light would look good? I know it, like these are really elegant, but you get kind of over here to the farmer's market and it turns a little more rustic. So I thought this light might look cool. I kind of like it. What is everyone saying fart jars for? Get out of here with the fart jars. I have no room. I need to keep my egg sign. My goodness. More toast. No toasters. No. White kind of matches the vibe that's kind of going on here. This is what I walk into. It's, yeah, I'm so sorry. It's just been like this. Everyone's turned against me. And all I'm trying to do is live my life. And I'm just so sorry about anyone just jumping in. Um, so the next thing we need to do is put gold helmets on all the towers. We've already kind of started. So we need to we need to finish doing that. You can never enough, have enough toasters. <laughs> Where are my gold helmets? Or my, I need gold. There we go. Oh, yes. Fart jars. Egg fart jars. Oh, my gosh. Okay, it kind of makes sense when you put it that way. The only thing I could do is remove this gold nugget, but then it might ruin the gold nugget scavenger hunt. So, I, I can't. I'm sorry. I just don't have any room for your fart jars. How many helmets do we need? Let's figure that out. We need... These, these don't have any, right? One, two, three, four. Okay. And then it's five, six, seven, eight. We need eight helmets. Let's do it. Okay, I'm going to lose count, but here's one. All right, here's two. I'm gonna try really hard not to lose count. We all get to count together, all right? Nobody distract me. Here's three. All right, we're three helmets deep now. This is happening. We need five more. All right, here's number four. We're halfway there after this helmet. I'm trying really hard not to lose count, but stop talking about toasters. It's really confusing me. All right, here's five. All right, six, just need two more. Here's 
seven. And then here's eight. Why is it? What, oh, no, whoa, 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 whoa. Don't just put numbers. That's going to confuse me. Don't just throw numbers in chat. That's going to really be hard for me to see what I'm doing. Okay, we have enough. All I have to do now is, is put them up. That's nine, dude. No, it's not. Stop it. Huh. Huh. Oh, jeez. Place. Alright. There we go. Pull this out. Oh, I still can't get in there? Oh my gosh. I have to pull out four spaces? That's too many spaces. I'll probably just pick them up in the future. Place. There we go. that there. There we go. This is going really good. Oh, I just kicked up my path. That's really annoying. It was going good. Okay. Flowers. Uh, there. I'm like, wait, which button is it? Place. All the egg talk now, I want an egg sandwich. That sounds really good. That does sound delicious. Okay, I want to pick up the flower, but without kicking up my path. All right, it worked. That's good. It makes me feel good. Place. And then last one. Place. Perfect. Ah, dang it. Do you have any extra helmets? I do not. All right, so Joey, decoy ducks, soon, all that fun stuff. I was thinking we would we'd customize the decoy ducks to make Joey's operation look a little more legit. I don't know. It could be fun, right? I think we'd get rid of this. I need something else to put the ducks on. Let's see. Let's customize the ducks. There's no gold duck, so it's just kind of like whatever looks good, right? Let's do a few random ducks. They're decoys and ducks, it fits perfectly. <laughs> it does. Um. Okay. And how's it going? All right. Maybe Cyrus has a version. Shame isn't open. Oh, he's open for a little bit longer. We got about like 40 more minutes. If we wanted. All right, so I got these ducks. And we need to get like a counter... Just something to put them on because I think it'll look cool and make it look like he's displaying them. That's not how we use this. Tracy, we'll see you later. 
What are we gonna display them on? It's gotta be something good. It could it could be this wedding head table. I am thinking it could actually work. It could also be this. <laughs> uh, but that's a little, I don't know. It's a little too big. And then I was thinking it could be something as simple as like the, the counter table. But it's not really fancy enough. So let's try that. I'm going to try the, the wedding head table. Okay. Duck. All right. Duck. I kind of like the randomness of it. What do you guys think? <laughs> it's it's a bit strange, right? Moroccan tray tables? Ah, I don't have those. I know what you're talking about, though. Different idea. Different idea. balloon oh no that's not good I don't feel like fixing that right now be a slingshot as a piano bench that's not what I need at all I don't know what we're doing here <laughs> It's kind of, it, it's, I, I don't know, it's kind of funky. I mean, it's very gold core over here, and then it's ducks. And I don't, I don't love that. But I do like, I will say this. I like the idea of one decoy duck. Like right here. But not facing that way. Like that. Just for fun. You know, we just kind of shove him in there you know he's wishing for a better life and then i like these here and so i think we should just put something more gold core on top of them and call it a day you know because i think they're pretty cool right i feel a bit off they're even though More gold? Well, yeah. That's what I'm. That's what I'm talking about. I just don't know what kind of gold. It's got to be something flipping awesome, right? And two of them. Are you allowed to share dodo codes? Uh, we have a section for that in our Discord. I'd prefer it if you didn't put them in chat here. I do not have a lot of items left that go on tables. If 
We have gold bars. I wish there's like, in terms of things um, around the island, there's not much left that's of significance. So I was trying to think of other things we could put that would kind of match the vibe and also have some level of like meaning to them. But I think the well is like dry right now. So I'm just kind of looking through these things. Gold toaster. No, thank you. It could be piles of cash. There are so few items that go on top of tables. There are just so... Like, what do I do? Yellow pumpkin. Gold plate. I don't have the decorative plates I need to make the golden plates. Although those look really cool. I'm kind of thinking the nuptial bell. I got rid of it. I'm actually thinking maybe that was the wrong call. Maybe what I'm what I should do is keep the nuptial bell here and put a decoy duck inside that. Farchar, stop it. Um, let's see. Yeah. So this has been here the whole time. And it's fine. I'm just kind of wondering what could go inside. What could we what could we put in there? Fart jar core. Terrariums and gold. Uh, I don't know if I have the recipe for that. Unfortunately. Oh, I do, I do, I do. Okay. Iron nuggets and clumps of weed. Sweet. Weeds. What's, uh, I can't believe I didn't put any of these on my island the whole time. They're such a good item. Let's go find the iron and weeds. Craft. I completely forgot about these and you can make them gold. Did I not get customization kits? I thought I had them already. Crafting quite a few of these. I probably am only going to use one right now, but... <laughs> Terrarium. There it is. Yep. Gold terrarium. Such an excellent item. I cannot believe I forgot about this. Cool, I think those are just what we needed. I don't know if they'll be what I put in here, but they gotta go somewhere, right? Um, let me just try it in here. Oh, that looks fantastic. Uh, that, that does stay in there. Um, yeah. We could put one over here. Maybe, I don't know. Dang it. Um, no. Getting 
kind of laggy over here. <laughs> That's a shovel. Try again. I could put one right here. The tent's going to block it. I'm going to have a tent here tomorrow, so... Eh. Can't delete the island. Work too hard on it. Turned out amazing. But I, I'm not... It's not done yet. There's still a, a very high risk of, of this island needing to get deleted if I don't, if I don't finish what we're doing. Up here. Definitely up here. Like, we, we kind of skipped out on this area early, I feel like. And a terrarium could go, like, right in the spot. Uh, come on. Come on, terrarium. Oh, my gosh. I just needed to, like... I don't know. Is that a bad spot? I was hoping I could get it a little more further down. Kind of like that, but in the middle. Let me try one more time. Yes. Like that. Okay. Oh, I managed to jump over. Sweet, I thought it was trapped. And then if we want to put something down here, we could put the last one... I don't know, in here somewhere if we wanted to. I think we're good. Oh, 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 maybe up here? Uh, no. Oh, what about right here? Remember hours ago when we, when we wanted to put something here? And I couldn't figure out what? Maybe what if it was this? Okay, it keeps me from walking, so let's just... Yeah. That's pretty good. Okay, great. Guys, it's been five hours, but I think we're just about there. I think we're we just about finished the island. I gotta pick up this crafting table and get the heck out of my way. Um, actually, what items do I have on me? I'm gonna replace my gold slingshot real quick. <laughs> Because when am I going to have time to do that? Lori, thank you for the super sticker. Appreciate you. I don't deserve it. I've gone loopy the last hour or so. And I'm subjecting everybody to it. I was saving the longest stream for last. I even have one tree left over. I can't believe it. Okay. Just dump all this stuff out of my inventory. Good. I need to sell the excess Lily of the Valley because we're good now. I don't need any more. Don't forget to make slash wrap the gold wand. Yes, that's the next thing I'm going to do. Um, I still need my crafting table to make that, but whatever. Let me get to that in a sec. 
Um, so we gotta we gotta wrap up the gold wand and it's probably something else, some other treat for them. So we'll need a crafting table for that. Let me take care of the last lilies that are plaguing my. Ah, uh, uh, you know, a terrarium like right there would look good. I gotta dig these things up. I don't know if anyone here edits videos, but this island is is kind of the same thing. You can you can end up editing a video, and it can be done, and then you can find a hundred more things to do to it if you just keep tweaking it. So at a certain point, you just kind of have to tell yourself like, no, 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 we're good. We did a good job, and the island is done. That's what we need to tell ourselves. But there are just a couple tiny little things. Tiny, tiny, tiny little things. We should just make sure we do. Love the island. Thank you. I I think it turned out. Oh, I was going to say my slingshot, but I actually did just craft a new one. Wait. <laughs> Let's just wait for it down here. We did good. It's a fantastic island. open food mess that was not worth it I'm gonna sell that with these uh, lilies Mahalo is the best name for this beauty <laughs> it's a pretty good name How much is this tree worth? Oh, <gasps> what a ripoff. Guys, this money tree has 30,000 bells. Hold on. This money tree, I'm not kidding, has 30,000 bells on it. And if I go to sell it right now, they will give me 192 bells. Wow. I cannot believe these scam artists. Are you flipping kidding me? No. I will prove it to you. I will prove it right now. Look at this. Okay. 10,000 bells. 10,000 bells. 10,000 bells. Or I could have gotten just shy of 200 bells. What a freaking rip off this box is. And Nook's like, what? Wow. These scumbags should be totally ashamed. That is not how you appraise things. If I... You're handing them 30,000 bells and they think it's worth 192 bells? Then the stuff that they do pay a lot of money for, imagine how much you could get if you just sold it to, like, someone else. Like, they are undervaluing every single item you own. I'm just appalled. Okay, well, our last money tree is gone, so that's it. We really do have to be done. Ugh. We have to get the last items we need for uh, resident services. It is going to be... I don't even know how to make a wand. Um, here, hold on. Let's let's look at this. Let's look at this. Gold nuggets and star fragments for the wand. Okay, let's start there. Gold nuggets, star fragments. That's gonna make a wand. 
gold wrapping paper for wrapping it. And I think I'm going to grab a customization kit. I'm going to grab... I think I have one. I'll be honest, if I do, I don't know where it is. I wanted to grab one of those little handheld lanterns. Here. I'm like, I knew I saw them. I want to customize it, and I want to see if I can put something cool on it and then make that, like, another item they get. Because if I'm giving them the golden wand, I want them to be able to dress however they want to dress. So if, if I give them the wand and a crown, it's kind of like, oh, okay, which one do you want me to use, you know? Okay, uh, craft or customize, what do I want? I want, first of all, customize. <laughs> Geese, right? <laughs> <laughs> um mm, probably geese because everyone will think it's ducks and there's like a lot of duck re references yeah pretend they're ducks that's what I'm thinking too and then we need to craft the wand I'm going to craft another one because this one's going to be for everybody else. I want one for me. Okay. And let us wrap. Let us wrap. <laughs> I said let us wrap. Let us wrap the wand and duck lantern. Perfect. You're still streaming? How's it coming? We are pretty much done. Uh, I'm just doing these last couple little things for resident services. Just for folks visiting the island via Dream Stream. Or Dream Island Tour, I should say. Oh, and there's a couple of trees I want to put on the beach, too. I love lettuce wrap from P.F. Chang's. Oh, those are good. You're, you're not wrong about that. Those are incredible. So, the trees in question are um, from the this. They're in here. I had an extra, extra floor light in here, apparently. Random junk that I ordered yesterday. I need my other trees. Cool, these are for that beach that got kind of left behind. Okay. Perfect. did good so I have to get back here somehow <laughs> how do I okay there we go I want the presence to face a certain direction so I'm kind of torturing myself right now but we're gonna put one drop like that I don't think they face different directions, actually. I don't know why I'm bothering with, like, getting the correct angle. <laughs> we gotta turn this, um, on. There we go. That's the noise I like to hear. And drop. Nice. So if our folks who are dreaming find them... 
they can have those presents and roam around the island in style. Cool. Uh, I saw a balloon in the distance. I don't care, though. And this beach is where I wanted to put these excess trees. Just because we kind of started using them, so it's like, why not? I think maybe like that. And like that. Yeah. There we go. Just because. Cool. Um, wow, I think I'm like officially out of things to do, finally. The other altar wasn't on. Are you sure? Let me look. That one's definitely on, for sure. And that one's, I think that present's glowing. Yeah, that's glowing. What about, that one's on. Brewster is on, yep. It's maybe done. I think it's done. Uh, th so one question I have for you guys is how do you create a post that stays here for people who are dreaming? Like if I create post, how do you, like, I know you can do it. Is, is it going to be obvious when I start doing that? Because I'm going to write some some different things on here. Hoping that people will read it. It won't be required. But just hit create post and it'll stay. Okay, so anything you write for your friends or whatever. If you upload your Dream Island, it all stays on the board. But none of this stuff obviously does. Because this is all from the game. Okay. Fantastic. Thank you. I love the way it turned out. I really do. I think uh, I think this was such a cool project. I wish I had done it all in one shot. I wish when 2.0 came out, I had like just started really getting to work on it. But uh, I had to collect all the items and then all these other games. And then eventually I hit some burnout and needed to stop decorating for a bit. So... Yeah, it didn't happen in the time frame I wanted, but it feels good to have it done. Uh, okay, so probably what I'm going to do, probably, uh, is I'm going to play tomorrow. I'm probably going to put down some different items and things like that, just kind of hide some things around the island tomorrow. And I'm going to do my final checks. So I need to make sure I amiibo in a campsite villager, um, I've already put a toilet in the arena, so we're good there. I gotta fill out the notice board. Um, I gotta put another item next to Nooks for like the flyover. So that's gonna be cool. Um, yeah, so that's like just, I'm just gonna do my big dummy check. And then tomorrow at, I don't know, probably around five o'clock island time, I will upload it. The dream island or the dream address will be there. And it'll be great. There's going to be a lot of fanfare. <laughs> I'm, I may record a tour as well tomorrow if we have time. So we'll see. I'll, I'll try. Um, yeah, it came across or it came, it came out awesome. So we're going to raid Katana again. Uh, I'm looking now who is playing Animal Crossing, by the way. I said last night they were playing Animal Crossing when it was actually Pokemon, and I did not know that. But I'm, I'm looking at their stream. It is indeed Animal Crossing. <laughs> so if you stick around, um, YouTube should kick you over there, and you can say hello, say Cross Minute Raid, and yeah, it should be awesome. Thank you all for hanging out for a super long stream. Um, I'm probably not going to stream tomorrow because I want a break. Maybe Sunday, though. We'll see. And, uh, yeah. Let me do the redirect real quick here. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Done. All right. It's going to redirect you guys in just a bit. Thank you so much. I will see you later. Enjoy touring the island. I will post 
I guess, on Discord and the community tab when the, when the um, dream address is up. So you guys can check it out. Thanks, everybody. This was awesome. I'll catch you later.